All right, guys, so we are going to get started. You guys like my hoodie, by the way? Anyway, um, so the official release for Sammy came out. So if you don't know what Sammy is, it's essentially it's Leoran board, but they rebranded. We're not going to get into the whole reason why they're rebranding and everything, but you can just think of Sammy as like, it's the same thing as Leoran board. It's just whatever, okay? Uh, so if you are using Leoran board for your stream, um, you can update to Sammy now. Uh, if you don't know what Leoran board or Sammy is, it's similar to streamer bot. So all the stuff that I use to run on all, all of the stuff that I do on my stream, like the effects that I run, like stuff like really simple stuff like this, but also more complicated stuff like, uh, I don't know, like this. We use a program called streamer bot to do that. Sammy can basically do all of the same things. So we're gonna look at Sammy. I haven't actually used Leoran board uh, in like months. So I'm just gonna go into this blind. I'm gonna go into this blind. I don't really know how to use it. And we're gonna like do a deep dive into Sammy, see how it works. And then uh, eventually we're gonna make a video comparing Sammy and streamer bot. And we might talk about like mix it up in that video as well and ATEM and all the other stuff. Uh, primarily, uh, I want to compare Sammy to StreamerBot because I think those are like the two best programs for this kind of stuff. There's like way too many things here, so what's, we're just gonna download it. All right, so we're gonna go here, download it. This is the new release. Um, and I guess we're just gonna we're gonna make a Sammy folder. Sammy. So it says. This is a virus. We're going to hack your computer and install all sorts of cryptocurrency miners. Yep, I'm going to keep that. I'm just kidding. I'm not going to do that. Um, this is the way to change my CSS, Java, Python, and C Sharp so I can use it on my streamer bot. Uh, they're not really analogs. You can't really just convert like that. I don't know what you mean. You, you can't really convert. CSS to C sharp. They're not really equivalent things. Uh, okay, so we're just going to extract it here. Now, how do I set this shit up? <laughs> how do I set this up? Um, we should have some Sammy people, people from the Sammy community in chat, so they might help me out. I'm not going to read all these improvements because it's not really relevant to me since I'm starting from scratch. But... Uh, I need to know how to set this up. So let's go. There's Sammy core patch notes. Okay. How do I, how do I do shit? I'm just pretending like I'm some normie person that's never used this before. Cause I actually haven't used it before. So like, what is Sammy downloads, blah, 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 help documentation. Here we go. I'm going through this as if like I'm a normie person that's never used this before. Uh, so we're going to connect it to Twitch. It does connect to YouTube, uh, but we're not going to worry about YouTube stuff for now. So step-by-step -step tutorial. Okay. Download Sammy. Got it. Launch Sammy. Navigate. So we're going to open up Sammy core. Okay. We're going to do that because that's what they told me to do. Okay. Allow access. Yep. Cool. Okay, so this is Sammy. Hello there, Sammy. Um, okay, so how do we do this? The first thing I'm gonna do is I'm going to get this connected to OBS. Um, so this is gonna connect to OBS and then it's also gonna, gonna connect to Twitch. So let's go connect to OBS. Uh, WebSocket, this is all fine. I need to put in my password. So she... I'm going to open up my password manager. By the way, on the topic of password managers, don't don't tell my sponsor this. I currently use something for free that's called Bitwarden, but in the next two weeks, there's going to be like something for NordPass. They can't know that I don't use NordPass, okay? Don't tell them. <laughs> I'm going to get in trouble. <laughs> okay, I'm going to put in my password in here. Then click connect. Okay, it says it's connected. Done. Let's set it to auto connect. 
let's set it to auto connect. So you just connect it to OBS. By the way, you of course need to have OBS WebSockets installed. Oh, okay. So here's a here's a difference. So um, this is pretty important. I don't know if you guys are gonna care about this. This is pretty important. Uh, OBS WebSocket 5.0 is coming out. Uh, when you're if you if if I turn this into a video, by the time you watch this, like in eight months or something from now, WebSocket 5.0 would be built into OBS Studio. Um, but I don't have that up right now, so I'm still using the old one. But these are very different; they're not compatible with each other. So I'm just, I'm gonna stick to this version. Ew, ads, let's get rid of them. What up, strikes? I did this up for six months. Thank you very much. Uh, okay, we got to connect to OBS, done. Let's get it connected to Twitch. Connect to Twitch, auto connect to Twitch. Edit, connect. Fail to locate default account. What? Oh, open URL, okay. Shit. You gave me a warning. I don't think I'm supposed to show the screen. Anyway, authorize. We're done. <sighs> Can I just complain for one second, okay? <sighs> Times New Roman. Yo, if I'm the Sammy people, design a really cool page, okay? So it's like official and stuff. Anyway, this is me complaining. <laughs> Alright, so it's connected. This is nice. It shows my... Thing it's connected here, done. Everything's cool. Listen to new follows, hype train, all this stuff. This is pretty cool. Oh, so this is nice. Okay, okay. So I've connected my Twitch account here. Uh, if you click edit, this is where you can put in all your different channel point rewards. Um, so I think this, this these are all the channel point rewards that are already here. And on the right, it says owned. And you can see that it says no for everything. So basically the way channel points on Twitch work, it's very annoying. But um, if you, I don't wanna to have to go through explaining all this. Basically, uh, if you wanna make a channel, like do something where Leoran Borg can like turn on and off channel points or like change the price of channel points. It can only do that for channel points that Leoran Borg, or sorry, I keep calling it Leoran Borg. It can only do that for channel points that Sammy itself has created. So for example, all of these channel points were made in StreamerBot. So if I wanted to do something in Sammy to like change the points of this touch fuzzy get dizzy thing, I can't do that because it's not owned by Sammy. It wasn't made by Sammy. So make sure like whenever you create channel point rewards, it has to be done within Sammy. Um, we're just going to create a new one for fun. It's not going to do anything right now. What's up, Um, I like pizza. I don't know what this. <laughs> I don't know what this is. We're gonna make it like, yeah. Set set a color red. Cool. Mmm, pizza. This this is not gonna do anything. You can redeem it right now, but it won't do anything. Save. And so now I can turn it on and off. So right now it should be off. Actually, just so you know what I'm talking about. I'm doing a tutorial on a program I've never <laughs> used before. <laughs> I'm doing a tutorial on a program I've, I've, I've never used before. Actually, I'm gonna turn off all my channel points from StreamerBot just um, to make it simple for us. So don't, you guys won't be able to redeem stuff today. So you can see here I have no channel points, right? But I can actually turn off. See this one that we created that's called I like pizza. We can turn it on. And if we turn it on, it turns green. It should appear right here, right inside streamer button and then turn it off. And, and there it is. But you'll notice that all of the other channel point rewards that I have here, they're all grayed out and I actually can't turn them on and off. So that's what I'm talking about. It's because StreamerBot didn't actually create the channel point reward. And so like I it, I can't turn it on and off because it doesn't have control over it. So you only you can only control channel point rewards that say owned here. So if you want to like convert stuff over to Sammy from um I'm going to keep saying Leoran board. If I say Leoran board I really mean Sammy. Um if you want to like convert stuff over from like 
something that isn't owned by uh, Sammy into something that is owned by Sammy, then just click this thing that says duplicate. So this wholesome sound, we can make a duplicate. I'll make a copy of it and then you can just like edit it and you can go into your Twitch dashboard and just delete the original one if you want. Um, but this one now I have, I can, uh, I can actually change the cost of it and stuff, which I couldn't before. You can't edit, you can't edit these ones. Ooh, I accidentally made a duplicate. Um, I can't edit any of these cause it doesn't own. It's not owned. Anyway, we're going to delete this. How do I delete it? Delete. We don't need that. Um, I love that you have called Sammy, Leoran Board, and Streamer. Fucking, what? You know what I'm talking about, okay? Okay, done, done. The window must be open in order to link a Twitch account. I have, if you already linked your Twitch account, you can close it. Okay, I'm pretty sure that you can get rid of this prompt. I don't think you need to tell people this anyway. But you can also connect more than one Twitch account, I think. Right? You can connect more than one, right? Or no? Can we? <laughs> Let me just try that. Don't tell me if I can or not. Okay, fine. You already told me. So I'm assuming you can connect like a bot. We're going to do that, actually. Open URL. Uh, I'm going to open up another window and log into my nutbody account so if you have like another bot that you use you can log in with that one as well which is what i'm gonna do so let me log in all right i need to log in it's asking for my code give me a second okay Otherwise, it would have looked better. Okay. Let me log in. P A S S W O R D. Oh, should I say that out loud? Fuck. You guys didn't hear that, did you? Okay, authorized. Done. So now I have my bot account in here. Join chat under this name. What does this mean? Join chat under this name? Okay. Interesting. Oh, okay. So this is so it this account is not affiliate an affiliate, so I actually can't make it I can't listen to subs or that makes sense. Penis. God P E N I S. We're in. <laughs> okay. So Here's how Sammy works. You got this UI here. Oh, we need to set a bridge, don't we? That's what we need, right? Bridge. Ooh, Christina's extensions, official extensions. Select the bridge. Open in a browser. Sammy. So I think this URL needs to be open all the time, right? Bridge is only for extensions now. So do we need bridge at all? Do I need that at all? Or do I, can I just use this program? You can only chat on Twitch under one name and you can't change it, change in an easier way. Wait, you can only chat on Twitch under one name. Is that a question or is it a statement? You can add the URL as a doc, but what, what I mean is do I need Sammy deck? Cause Silverlink said I oh, bridges only for extensions. We'll look at extensions, of course, but we'll, we'll do that later. If we don't need it, we, I won't set it up. On the settings for streamer bot. Hey, yo, we are, we ain't talking about streamer bot right now, okay? <laughs> if you want to have extensions, yes, it needs to be open. If you want to use the test buttons, it also needs to be uh, open. Otherwise, not. Test buttons. Okay. All right. I guess we'll open it up. Uh, oh, by the way, there's also an app, apparently. Uh, or you can, it's it's also web-based, kind of like in StreamerBot. So you can set up, we'll show you it, but you can, we should just set up a page first and then, and then you guys will see what I'm talking about. Let's just set up bridge here. 
Uh, we're just going to keep this open. You can, you can, of course, add this as a doc inside of OBS so you don't have to keep opening it in your browser. I'm not going to bother doing that right now. Uh, let's just create a thing here. Add a new deck. We're going to call this mm, nut. Yeah. Adaptive resizing. So this is like a big ass 100 button stream deck kind of thing. So if you go in here and create a button and then we can make it do stuff. All right, let's make it do stuff. Plus OBS commands. Let's do, let's just do, just do something real simple. Change scenes, change blend mode. Okay. Fuck, this is a lot of things you can do. <laughs> this is a lot of stuff. Okay. All right. Whew. Event subscription. Create it. You can even create scenes. That's nice. So the one thing I like about this so far is you can do way more. It it natively supports way more OBS actions compared to StreamerBot. So if you're using StreamerBot, right? And you like right click and you add like a thing. These are the only OBS actions you have access to. And if you want to do more, you have to do OBS raw. But this seems to support like way more things like changing, setting a transition settings. Like there's way more stuff you can change here, but we're going to do simple. We're going to go set active scene, switch scenes. Main scene. You know what? Main. Oh, okay. I was afraid that I was going to have to type it in. I was like, no. <laughs> I have one complaint already. Not a complaint. It's in alphabetical order, which is not a problem. I guess that's not a problem. <laughs> Just ignore me. It's not a problem. Wait, why is this here? What if it just showed in the order of my actual OBS scenes? Yeah, I know you can type the search. All right, let's just change scenes to my desktop scene. And then save button. We can also run it. So I, I'm assuming this is the test button. That's so nice that it ha actually has a test button. One of the things I I should write notes about this because like like I said, even though I'm I'm still gonna stick with streamer bot, there's a lot of things I like about Sammy that I like. Like number so let me just write all the positive stuff, okay? So like supports way more OBS actions. Also has an actual test button. Cause like one of the things with streamer bot is like there, you can't like, if you make a command, like there's no way to actually test it in the program. You have to link it to like a command or like a channel point or like link it to your stream deck, which is really annoying. Like there's no actual button to just test it out. Um, and then say we want to switch back to, let's like make something that has multiple things. Yeah. Can we add a delay? Is that a thing you can do? Delay, wait. Wait for timeout. What is this? Wait for you. Ooh, wait for user input. Okay, wait for timeout. Is that is that what I think it is? Nobody tell me. <laughs> copy. There's a copy button. Paste. Fuck, this is actually pog, guys. Um I got a reaction scene. So if we test this out, I'm expecting this to go to my desktop scene, which I'm already on. Then a second later goes back to my reaction scene. Yeah, you see, I see that. So basically think of this like a, like a multi-action. So it goes to my desktop, goes back to reaction after a second. That's pretty cool. That's pretty pug. I like it. You ever been about connecting StreamerBot with other programs or HTML pages? I don't have a video on that yet, but you can do that in StreamerBot. 
Noise. Noise. They have a link to open the documentation straight up, which is cool. You know what I think would be cool as well is a, a direct link. Maybe it already has it, but a direct link to this page for the people that want to use all of this stuff. Um, let's see what else we can do. Let's instead of a scene switch, let's do a let's do a Twitch command. Let's send a message. You can create a clip. You can join a channel. Pokemon. <laughs> Is that really a thing? You can join. Okay, I'm not going to put that in there. We're looking at uh, Leorn board. You can end a poll. You can create a. This is nice. This is nice. You can create a poll. Yeah, you can like. Um, this is one of the things about Streamerbot which I don't like. Um. In Streamerbot, you have no way to create polls. I actually had to go out of my way and like make my own poll thing. That's what's on my GitHub. Like I made a template for creating polls. I had to actually make this myself. But this is like just natively supported inside of Sammy. Sammy. Fucking. We're looking at Sammy. Did I say streamer bot again? Create polar prediction with one button press. Yeah, you can just create it here. Wait, login name. What's login name? Do I need that? Is P stored in the balls? Yes. No. Duration. 60 seconds. I don't know what login name is. Can we just like test this out? Run. The login is your name. Yes, you need it. Like my Twitch name? Like I do need it? Okay. Did this work? It worked? Okay. I'm not exactly sure why you need your login name. There's probably a reason why. And if you do need your login name, why don't why don't they just make a drop down to make it easier instead of you having to type it out? Is there a reason why you need it there? It pulls the OAuth. So why doesn't it just do it automatically? Or give you a drop down so you can pick. And then you guys can vote. The actual overlay overlay in the screen that you see, it's powered by streamer bot, but you can you can recreate it in Sammy. In case you have a bot and yourself added, you can choose the account. So why didn't they make it like a drop down? Like a selecting thing. So what if I misspell my name, you know? Anyway, I'm just, I'm just, uh, I'm just complaining. I was just, I was just wondering. <laughs> Try it? Try what? Also, the originator of the poll doesn't matter as long as they have permissions, though. Yeah, I just, I don't understand. I guess I just don't understand why you need to have, have it there. Like, if you misspell your name, you need to go back to school. It's not about that, though. Like, I've made software in the past. It's it's about making it easier for the end user. It's not about me complaining <laughs> or anything like that. Like you need you need to have the expectation that like the end user is gonna like fuck up stuff like that. You know. Like for example, I found someone on Twitch. His name was the word what, but with like twenty two A's. What if you put twenty one A's? You know what I'm saying? His name was his name was. That was his name. Like, what if he misspells that, you know? Chat with Nutbody. Um, Coom, am I right? You go, girl. Nuh-uh. Oh, oh no, he didn't. Do you have to, I want to run it without saving, see what happens. So it didn't work. I put nut body in here and it didn't work. 
Yeah, I guess I guess someone probably already answered it in chat. I guess I just don't understand. It's all right. I I don't need to know. Not important. <laughs> I'm assuming that I actually created the poll on Nutbody's channel. But that... That doesn't make sense though. Like what? Anyway. I'm not going to complain. Um, okay. So that polls work. What else can we do? There's there's a lot. I I am really impressed with like the number of things that you can do. So apparently Twitch predictions choice array name. Oh, you would have to make an array. Okay. So I guess you can do utilities numbers variables. If statement, rename, will repeat, break, case statement, switch statement. Look at these freaking nerds, dude. Clamp. String. Array. You can create an array. Okay. Um, choices. So if we wanted to make a prediction, how would we do that? I want to see if I can do it intuitively. Can you compare resource consumption? Uh, I could. I don't really know. I, I don't think there's a meaningful difference. Like, there's not going to be a meaningful difference between the two. Like, it's like point, less than a percent on my CPU. All right. Every time I go in Task Manager, it freaks out. I don't think there's a meaningful difference between the two. Like, if your computer can't ran, run Sammy, it's... I don't know what to t tell you. <laughs> Hello, Snickle, Snick, Snickley. Yeah, you gotta make an array with the choices, and then I guess you have to go array insert. So this is a thing that like normie people are gonna be like, what? Like, if you're a programmer, you get this, but normie people are gonna be like, this is confusing. Uh, choices. Value to insert. Uh, Woohoo! Copy, paste. I like the copy pasting stuff. Balls. Um, the face. And we'll we'll make it a channel channel point prediction with three options. Just so we can test it out. Twitch. Create prediction. Login name. Again, I don't know what the login is for. Prediction name. Um, what's the best? Choices. Duration. 60 seconds. Let's see if this works. Run. You need at least two outcomes. There are, bitch. Sorry. <laughs> Wait, did I do this wrong? Is this not how you do it? I thought there's more there's more than two options. Did I do this wrong? You need two outcomes. There's more than there's three. Or am I stupid? Change the insert position. Top. But it's inserting at the top. Load array. Fucking, this is some nerd shit, guys. Object to array, stringify array. What the fuck are you guys talking about? Top, I think, is one. Top, middle, bottom. I'm a power bottom. What are you talking about? Maybe there's no load. Okay, one, two, three then. This is not intuitive, guys. <laughs> I'm going to be honest. This isn't very, very intuitive. But that's okay. I'm not going to criticize it for it. I'm just saying, like, I don't get it. 
Predictions just have two up. No, they don't. They, you can have up to 10. That's the whole point. The whole point is you can have up to 10. Um, near the docks. Okay. Send a chat message. Create a clip. Game info. Basically, my, my goal today is to just, like, see what kind of things I can create. And, like, maybe if I can see if I can make, so, like, recreate something in Sammy that I have in streamer bot. Create a prediction. Choice array name. Name of the array containing all your outcomes. Minimum 2, maximum 10. Yeah. Login name. All lowercase. Question displayed, maximum 60 characters. Usage example, okay. Oh my god, are you serious? Okay. It doesn't know, so you basically, you, you kind of need to be a programmer to like understand this stuff. Like, it, it's expecting a string. And that should probably work. It's because they're expecting a string, that's why. I'm um so yeah you guys can do channel point predictions i'm going to cancel it don't worry so like you can dump in as many channel points as you want here guys also the the, the channel point prediction you see in the screen is also broken my my widget only supports two options i'm going to make i'm going to make one that supports up to 10 eventually Um, I'm not a programmer. Yeah, but like, what I'm saying is like, someone who isn't a programmer is not going to understand the difference between this and this. You know what I mean? This is not a complaint. This is, this is more just like a, you know, FYI kind of thing. Okay. Do you got, how many channel points did you guys put in? 12,000. Okay, I'm going to cancel it. Wait, how do I cancel it? <laughs> can I cancel it from? Can I cancel it from here? Wait, how do I cancel? Twitch commands. Prediction and prediction. Status canceled. Prediction ID. Oh, I don't even know what the ID is. Okay, I'm going to have to do it within the thing here. Because I don't know what the ID is. Delete? Delete and return points. Cool. I mean, you have a point because there can't be another type of value aside from a string. Well, it could be like an integer, you know. I guess it like try to tries to auto figure out like what it's supposed to be. Anyway, it's not a criticism. It's just me just figuring this stuff out. Because, like, to be fair, this kind of stuff is not any easier in streamer, but I, I had to make it easier. Like, I made this. I feel like this is pretty intuitive. Um, But you, you... Yeah. By the way, if you want this code, it's on my GitHub. This one's on my GitHub as well. So, th basically, this thing here... Um, I imagine in both Sammy and Streamerbot, they'll probably have something more intuitive in the future. Maybe, I don't know. Um, but in Streamerbot, uh, there's no way to like make pre-made polls or pre-made predictions. So I'll give you an example. Uh, in the game I call a play called Super Metroid, there's like a poll question that a lot of question, a lot of streamers constantly run. And like normally when you run a poll without any of these programs, you would have to manually type in poll in chat and then fill out, fill out all of these things here and then blah, 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 blah. But with, uh, if you make, if you use my template here, you can like assign it to like a button on your stream deck or like a command that you can type in chat. Uh, and it'll like pre make the poll for you. So we'll set the duration. We'll set, we'll select like whatever the question is. Uh, and all you have to do to like set up the template is just edit these fields here. So like in in my case it would be like save or kill the animals, right? You just put that in there. Um, 
So like, yeah. You get, and then you can just change the duration and all of the options in here. So it's like super easy, just a template. I don't know if anyone here would ever use that. Recently switch to streamer bot. I don't want to make another switch. You guys don't have to make a switch. I'm just covering both of them so that you know what the differences are between both of them. Cause I get a question. I get the question a lot. Like, should I use Sammy or streamer bot? Um, that's cool. How do I do like, wait, let's see what else I can do in here. This is exciting guys. Okay. What else can we do? Extensions, let's not worry about extensions right now. Utilities, open HTTP, uh, open URL, HTTP request, set date and time, okay. YouTube commands, we don't use YouTube, but it works with YouTube. File management, file copy, file exists. So this is all kind of stuff that I do in like written out code in C sharp, but it's kind of nice that it's just in here. Key exists. Switch commands. Let's try let's try to think of something, guys. What can we do? Save to kill them later for food. Actually, you know what? There's something I've been meaning to make for streamer bot. Um let me know if you guys would find this useful, okay? Let me know. You don't have to say yes, okay? Um, you guys know how you can make stream markers in chat or stream markers in Twitch? Like maybe you have a stream deck, you can press a button to make a stream marker. But one of the things that I don't like is that like when I make a stream marker, do you guys know what a stream marker is? Who here doesn't know what a stream marker is? Or we can do a clip as well. That was the second thing I wanted to do. You guys know what a stream marker is? Because it's built into, into the stream deck. So you can make a stream marker and then you can give it a title, right? Um, and when you make a marker, when you make a marker, you can go back, when you're done with your stream, you can go back into your VODs and it shows you like where you created that marker. So if, if there's a particular thing, like I've made a marker already, let's disable the clips here. I made a marker earlier. I made a marker earlier because I need to remember to go back there to like, make a video out of the thing I did here. And then I knew, this is another marker for like when I started doing the Leoran board stuff. Sorry, Sammy stuff. So I, I know for later, like when I started that, but like, I don't have a description. Like I don't have a description I can write. So I wanted to make a command for Twitch. Let me know if this is useful for you guys, okay? I wanna make a command for Twitch where Rather than just like having a button to create a marker and then you don't know what the marker actually means, right? Because there's no titles in it. I wanted to make it so that you can just type in marker in chat and then you can type in your description here so that later when you go back into your VOD, it shows the actual description here. You know what I'm saying? You know what I mean? Is that actually useful? Alternatively, I can also, I'm gonna do both. But I also may want to make another man command for clipping so that uh, maybe your mods can just type, uh, type in the clip command. It will automatically create a clip, but it'll also post the URL of that clip into Twitch chat so that you can immediately like watch the clip as soon as it's made. Unfortunately, you can't set like a title for clips because of the Twitch API. It doesn't let you do that. Um, that sucks. Yo, thank you, Lister Bungie. L Lister Bungie, thank you for the sub for two months. Guess who's back? You are, son. Sup? So like Marker, we talked about, yeah, we could do something like that. Like, like Marker, the time that we talked about balls and then we'll maybe have a message in chat that says like you've created a marker kind of thing um yeah you, you can make it send it you could make it automatically sent to twitter as well that's something you can do marker with cliff notes is a bonus yeah let's see if we can make that i was gonna make that in streamer bot but we'll we'll and i i will make it in streamer bot and i'll upload it to my github but I'll see if I can make it in Sammy first. 
just as an exercise to see if we can actually do it, you know? So how do we actually do it? Uh, I don't know. Actually, I might need some tips on how to do this because there is a create marker command, right? So description. So I want to, so we'll have to put our login name again, but I want the description to be what we actually typed in, into chat. So there's obviously going to have to be stuff before this. So like, the question is, how do I actually do that? <laughs> so let's see if I can figure it out. Variable window. Okay. Oh, the other thing is we haven't addressed yet is the triggers. So we want this to be triggered by chat messages, right? So this is where like, um, so this here, after you've made the command that I've only shown you guys like how to actually build the thing that you want to do. But like, how do you actually like trigger it? So like, let's let's stop talking about marker for a second. Um, let's just make it send a Twitch message. Twitch, can you just make it send a message? Join channel, send send the chat message. Um, I like Pi. Right, we'll save it, close it. Sorry, we should say pizza. Not, should say pizza, not pie. Save and close. So we want every time you guys use the channel point here, it should say, I like pizza in chat. It should say, I like pizza. Yo, thank you, Dr. Unjin. <laughs> Dur, Durunjin. Thanks. D D Runjun. Thank you so much. Hello, Landy. Um, yeah, that's what we're trying to do. I love cream getting cream pie. I mean, I love cream pies. Um, okay. So what I was saying was, uh, if you go to, if you, so this page here, sorry, you guys can't see what I'm looking at. This page here is like where you just build up the thing that you want to do. But how do you actually like hook it up to a channel point where you have to go back to this page? Let's make this a title. Where do I put the title for this, for the button? How do I change the label that's on it? I can't change the label here. I would have thought you could change the name of the button here. That would probably make more sense is if on the page you can actually just change the name. I'm assuming it's in the right click menu, yeah? Edit appearance. I like Pete's, we'll just call it pizza. Can I have, can I, can I have one piece of criticism? Wait, what the hell? What happened to it? Oh, I click cancel. Can I offer one bit of criticism to the streamer bot people? I love rounded corners. These rounded corners are a little bit aggressive. <laughs> maybe, maybe shorten the, maybe lower the corner radius just a little bit. It's a little bit of a little bit aggressive in the corner radius there. Just saying. Um, you can make him yeah, but 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 the default doesn't need to be like, you know what I'm saying. Also, what the hell is this? Anyway, don't care. You can change that too. Yeah, but I mean, but the default anyway. Right click, go to triggers, and this is where you decide like how you want this action to be um triggered which um i like this quite a bit this is one of the things i really wish that streamer bot had um and i'll tell you why in a second let's go here so we want this to be triggered by channel points so channel points and then redemption name will be i want this to be, be redeemed when you guys do where's the pie the pizza one didn't we have one for pizza? We didn't have one for pizza? Did we delete that? Hold up. I thought we had one for pizza. I like pizza. Where, where, where'd this one go? Where is this? Let's turn it on. What happened to our pizza command? <laughs> there ain't no pizza in here. Channel points. Oh! I think, I think because I added it, we have to reload it, right? Load from Twitch API. 
So we have to reload it. It doesn't like... It probably would make sense to just like auto reload it every time you open this. That's probably why. It didn't refresh. I had to manually refresh it. I like pizza. Um, yeah. Save. All right, do it. Redeem the I like pizza. It should like respond in chat that says I like pizza. Oh, it didn't do it? Shit. Wait. Did I do this wrong? <laughs> Why is this not working? Do I have to actually type it in? It says default is nut body, so I assumed I didn't need to write anything in here. It needs to be nutty. Why can't it be nut body though? I don't understand why it can't be nut body. Is it because I need to make it join the channel? But it is joined. What do you mean? I know it can be nutty. I don't want it to be nutty. I want it to be nut body. And I don't want to have to type it in here either because it says the default is nut body. That field indicates where the message is sent. Well, that doesn't make any sense. That's not intuitive. That's not the way that I would have. Nut body. Oh my god, you guys are typing to. <laughs> You guys are typing into this chat. <laughs> you guys are typing. So I can't, I can't send it. That, that doesn't seem right. Surely I can send it from the Nutbody account, right? Surely I can do that, right? There's no way. What are you guys saying? Set channel to nutty and nut body says it. Wait, what? That's so weird. But why? I don't, I don't understand that. So this is the channel. Okay, this this needed to be explained to me. I think that is a de destination, not who. Well, you should be able to... I think there should be able... You should have a field here that says, like, who you're sending it from as well, right? I think that would make sense. Like a who you're sending it from. It's because in Twitch connections, you have set nutbody to join channels. Okay. This stuff is unintuitive to me, but it's fine. As long as I, again, it's not me shitting on Sammy. Cause some people, can I just like save for a second? There's like some, some weird thing where people th like, didn't like me in the Sammy discord. Cause they're like, oh, you shits on, just cause he used a streamer, but now he shits on Lior and blah, 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 blah. And then people were like talking shit about me there. So like, guys. I'm just saying I didn't I don't understand like this stuff here. It's not me shitting on Sammy. It's just I don't get it, okay? <laughs> That's all. Anyway. So now now it's coming from my channel. See, I would I would really like to be able to just set the account that the message is coming from right here. Like now now it's coming out of my now it's coming out of my name and that's not what I want. You know what I'm saying? That's why I had selected join chat under this name. That's why I did it. It just, it just, you know what I mean? It just feels, does anyone else, am I making a convincing argument? Yeah, I know you're saying you can only have one chat as a, as a chat account. That's why I selected nut body. But if I made that my chat account, then it just makes sense to me that the messages here would be going to my account, right? And why would it be going out to the nut body? You know what I mean? It doesn't make sense for me that I would have to like do that. I also don't like how you have to keep manually typing in names here. It should really just be like a drop down. And then if you want to type in a random name, 
you know it should at least give you a drop down to select your anyway it, it, i don't know it doesn't make sense to me but it just feels a little bit unintuitive but i guess it works um i guess it works i don't know it just it seems unintuitive to me that I, I would have to make my bot account and then here I'd have to specify, yes, I want it into my sh my streaming account kind of thing. I don't know. Um, save. So it works. We can make stuff happen. Triggers. Now here's the interesting thing, okay? Here's the thing that I, I... One of the things I was interested in Sammy about because this is something you can't do in streamer bot and I find it really annoying. If I was to make a second button... Right? Using the exact same trigger, can I make it do different stuff? Oh yeah. Give me that pizza. Okay. Save and close. Now if you redeem it, does it do both messages? Oh, only just one? How come it didn't do both? Can you, can you not allow it to do both? Is that not a thing you can do? Save the board? I mean, really? You have to save the board? Is there a way you can save it without it closing like that? Okay, now it works. I feel like you should be able to save it without closing it. But anyway, point is, I'm nitpicking, okay? Don't worry, guys. Fucking people are gonna be talking shit about me again on the Sammy Discord. Um, so this is cool because you can do um, you can have multiple buttons that are triggered by the same thing, right? I have one channel point reward, but I can make it do two separate things, which is amazing. You can't do that in Streamer Bot. Technically, you can, but like. I, I, this is something I've disagreed with the, with the streamer bot people. They've said that they're not going to put this in, which I disagree with. Um, but here in streamer bot, you can only select one action to do, and that's it. If you want to do two separate actions, you'd have to like make a, another action and then run the two actions as sub action. It's really annoying. Like, you can do it that way. I don't like that you have to do it that way. Um, so I really like in Sammy how you can just like straight up make two separate actions and they'll run both of them. I'll run both of them. I like that a lot. So wait, hold up. Yeah. Yeah. What if I export this now? Export. Copy to clipboard. Import from JSON. Wait, what the fuck? <laughs> Wait, hold up. Delete. So if I if I went to a notepad, this is Pog. So this would I think this is I think and I don't know. I think this is whoa. What the fuck? Um, I think this is the equivalent of like you know how I show you guys how to import my code from GitHub. I think this is the equivalent. So if I was to like, wanted to give you guys this code, I could just give this to you, right? And then you guys can just import it. Does it keep all the triggers? It's like, does it keep all the triggers? We can import your beautiful pizza button. Wait, hold up. So let's pretend it wasn't a, a Twitch channel point because that's not gonna make sense to you guys. What if I wanted to, okay, this is Pog actually. Wait, this is Pog, okay? Um, Because this is something you can't do in streamer, but let's say I make an animation that's like for, for subs, right? What up, Gengar? Let's let's say I make an animation that's for for subs, okay? Um, and I go edit commands, 
Well, that's a cool sub, right? Let's test that out. Let's put the me so it's colored. Okay. Oh, by the way, I'm going to disable this pizza thing. Okay. Sorry. <laughs> Disabling the pizza thing for now. By the way, I think there should be a way that you can pause instead of just like straight up disable. Just so you guys... Any, if any, uh, any, uh, Sammy people in chat, if, if there's like a, maybe there is a way and I just don't know if there's a way that you can toggle it to make it just pause instead of turning off. I think that would be pog. Um, hold up. So if I made a sub alert, you can't do this in streamer bot. Okay. And it's annoying. Guys, somebody here install Sammy because I'm going to give you my, my code right now. But I think with a button, I'm not sure. Well, you should, you should be able to just do it from this menu, I think. Like make it a triple state button, maybe. Or maybe even like, I don't know. To make it simple, if it's too hard to put a triple state button, you can just like put it in here somewhere. Got it, boss. I got it open. Okay, okay. What I'm gonna do is I'm going to I'm going to copy. I'm gonna export this. It's a really really simple action. Okay. So whenever you guys sub, it's just gonna type that in chat. Okay. Um, I'm gonna export this. Let's go to paste bin. I'm just gonna put it right here. Okay, raw. Done. All right, everybody go to this link here, import that into your Sammy. And what I want you to check is I want you to check if it imported um, the triggers here. So if you right click, just just copy paste that, copy it. So go to the link, copy it and go import from JSON. And then check the triggers here to see if all the triggers are here. The channel still says nutty. That That's fine, that's fine. See, that's, that's why I don't want, that's why I would prefer if there's just like, this makes it complicated now. Cause if I'm trying to give my code to people, they're going to have to have to change, they have to change this instead of, of just having it paste or post directly to deck directly to the, I can't even fucking speak guys. <laughs> you know what I mean? I don't know. I, I disagree with having to put this thing in here. I think it should just know what your account is or what account that you want it to type to. I don't know. Feels unintuitive to me, but um, m more importantly, I want to check that the triggers are here. Auto substitutes the name. Wait, really? What if my name is Auto? <laughs> what up, Psycho Commando? I wish I could catch more of your live streams. You've been very helpful to me. Thank you, Psycho. I hope you had a good stream last stream after I raided you. Wait, I raided you last time, right? <laughs> Or when sharing, you remove the name, but you shouldn't have to do that. You know what I mean? Like if I make something, it, it, it should just be like, here's what I have. Let me give it to you. What if I had like 50 different things that had my name here, right? And then I know you're going to be like, oh, just put it as an argument, blah, blah, blah. But like, or make it like a variable. I don't know. It just, it makes it more difficult for people. Like, what I'm big about, the thing I'm going to keep pushing, everybody that makes programs um, like StreamerBot and Sammy and all those other programs, what I'm going to keep pushing them is like, your, your biggest, the biggest thing that's going to like put either one of these things over the top is like focusing on importing and exporting code. It's not about the ability to do really complicated stuff because like both of these things can do really complicated stuff. The idea is that smart people should be able to make really complex stuff, but they should be able to easily send that to people who are not technically literate. You know what I mean? Like I should be able to make something really complicated, but then go over to like uh, Jamichael over there who doesn't know anything about computers. And they're like, hey, I want that for my stream. Can I like have that? I can be like, sure, Jermichael, here's the code. You import it. 
They import it really easily and they, they should be ready to go. They don't need to do anything else. But as soon as you're like, oh, you're going to have to like go in and like edit your name and put it in here. It's going to be like stuff that Jamichael is going to be like, yo, bro, what is this shit? Okay. What is it? You want me to type stuff in? It's too much work. And they don't want to do it anymore. That's why I, it's really important for me. Um, what I really liked about Sammy is that like it imports all your triggers here. And you can't do that with StreamerBot. It's like the most annoying thing when I've been trying to share my code on Patreon. I know, I know I'm shouting myself. I'm plugging myself again. It's the most annoying thing for me when I'm sharing code because like if you guys are on Patreon, you'll know that like I write up like a like instructions for you guys. And one of the things I give you guys is my poll widget, right? People import my poll widget, but it's so annoying that like once you import my code for the poll widget, you then have to go over the platforms, then you have to go over the polls, and then you have to manually update all of these different things here. And then it's more complicated because some people are like, well, I already have something in here. And then it's like, okay, then you have to make another action, add your thing as a sub action, add my thing as a sub action, come back into here. And then you have to like, it's just so much fucking work, you know? And it's, it's not like a good experience when you're trying to like give code to people, which is why I like, uh, this is the big thing I really like about Sammy. Like, um, if you already have something that trigger that's triggered by like a poll action, like one of these poll things, it doesn't matter because you can have like, you can have two separate buttons that are triggered by a poll action thing. It's not going to interfere with anything you already have. And that way it just makes it way easier for me to like give code to people. What I, what I am wondering is what if I have two things? Can I, can I highlight like two things and give it to people? But if I, even if I can't do that, can I like give this whole, whole ass deck to people? Can I export this deck in any way? Surely I can, right? Is there a way you can, that'd be cool if you can edit a deck. And let's just say, let's just say this whole thing, this poll widget I made, I recreate this in Sammy. It'll be really, really cool if I could just like make a whole deck for that. Export that give that to someone they can import the code and creates a new deck. They don't even have to think about it They just import the deck and it'll just work They don't have to go through this whole bullshit of like Putting making sure all the triggers are right like I've done all the work and they can just import it, you know You can export a deck Copy deck there should be a can That should change to be consistent to be honest yeah, I think the option that there was like a right click export deck same way like export as like a JSON and I can just give people the code they can import it would be, would be pretty pog, right? Um, hey, what up Twix? Welcome. I love the trans <laughs> the, the trans coomer hoodie. I love trans coomers. What up Twix? Hello. Hey Twix, I made something that I think you might find funny. Or maybe you won't. You'll be like, what is this? Why did why? Why did you do this? You ready? Took me so fucking long to make. <laughs> yep. Copy deck is JSON. I know that you guys are saying that. You want to include all images? Yes. I heard you guys. Don't worry. And paste it in here. But how do I import that? Paste deck. Ah, ah, Sui, Pat, Pat. What does that mean? Wait, hold up. Can I translate that? Okay, so I can't give you guys my code. That's good. Wait, where's my chat? Oh my god, I have too many windows open. Translate. <laughs> Amazing. I see, I just got here right on time, of course. Yeah, that, that Evangelion thing took too long. Okay, wait, I can give you guys this, right? 
Let me see. Hold up. Let's let's change the deck. Oh yeah. Look at this. I'm going to I'm going to copy this deck and then I'm going to give this to you guys. Yeah? We'll make a new paste bin. You guys see if you can uh download that. New paste. All right, here we go, guys. Put this in your own. Put this in your own, Sammy. Hey, it worked! Wow, that's a cool sub. <laughs> it actually worked. <laughs> All right, chat. Import this into your Sammy. Tell me if it works. Hey, what up, Kid Glass? What up? Thank you for the tier one sub. Thank you, thank you, thank you. What up? I'm tr intrigued, mate. Have people been claiming this new version of LB will kill off streamer bot? No, it's not. Every time something new comes out, everyone's like frothing out the mouth. Is this a killer? It's the same thing with the phones. Whenever there's a new Android phone that comes out, is this an iPhone killer? Is this an iPhone killer? <laughs> like, no, it's just another option for people to use, you know? It doesn't need to be a fucking murderer. Is he gonna murder iPhone? Is he gonna violently assault the iPhone? Love the broadcast. Thanks, Kid Glass. Yeah, it doesn't have to kill off anything. It's just you use what you want to use. But what I, what I'm basically, I really really like the the fact that you can export everything with like all of your different. This is like. If there was a reason for me to switch to using Sammy, this would be it. Because like I like I write like a lot of code and I make a lot of widgets and stuff. And like this is so so much easier to share than stuff is in streamer bot. Cause think of it this way, I can like make my own self-contained like let's just say I make a widget for um for the poll thing, right? I can make it in its own self-contained deck. And I just have to think about what goes on in that deck. As soon as I'm done, I just click save, copy deck, and then I just put it on a paste bin and share it to people. And that's it. That's all I need to do. Even on streamer bot, like ignoring the fact that you have to set everything up here, you still have to go to the export option and then you have to manually check off like all the stuff here. Like even this is just annoying. Like, I don't like having to do this. And then you have to export it as a file. And then you have to, or like clip, whatever it is. Like, even that is a bit too much. I really like that I can just like have everything. If I make a widget, I can just like think of the widget as one deck in itself. Copy it, give it to people. They can, they can import it and they don't have to set anything else up. They don't have to go in and set the triggers for anything. They don't have to do anything. They just import it and they're done. So that's, that's probably the biggest strength so far that I like about Sammy. Isn't there a select all button? Select all button for what? You can't yet cry. Morning, fellas. What up, Bartek? Nutty will hate me. Wait, what did you do? You redeem it. Wait, who did what? <laughs> the printer setup is super rad. That's a photo of a piece of cl class I made. So cool to see it printed out live. Oh yeah? This? It's a physical thing that you made? It's a little bit dark in the printout. I'm sure it looks really cool in your actual profile picture. Streamer doesn't know. He doesn't know. He doesn't know, guys. You might sound dumb uh, and roast me if you have to, but what is Lee Orin board? So, the Orin board is a very similar program uh, to StreamerBot. If you know what StreamerBot is, if you don't know what StreamerBot is, then I don't, I don't know what to tell you because <laughs> we talk about it a lot. It's it's a stream automation tool, right? And it was previously called the Orin board. It's now called Sammy for reasons. They rebranded it to Sammy. So every time I say the Orin board, I really mean Sammy from now on. Um. El no sabe. What does that mean? He doesn't know. How dare you, okay? <laughs> Listen, I can translate your messages now. So you can't 
you can't be like my parents where you speak another language of time my, behind my back. Like you can't can't speak in Tagalog like when I'm in trouble. Okay, I can translate your shit. Okay. <laughs> Simply said, Sammy is like a free stream deck pro. Yeah, it's very similar to like a stream deck thing. Um, speaking of which, we pr should probably put this on our phone and see what it looks like. Trying to set up streamer bot to save and open a new project in FL Studio. Any leads? Uh, I don't know. I don't use FL Studio. I ain't, I ain't Mr. Dre. Uh, how about we try make our our barrel roll thing? inside of street uh same sammy <laughs> no web base deck yet for sammy oh i thought there was isn't that what this was sammy deck open sammy deck oh this is the this is a desktop based version okay gotcha can i just connect without a password select the deck ooh Low deck. I like pizza. I like pizza. I like pizza. Ooh, yeah. Give me the pizza. <laughs> I thought there were, were web-based decks, no? Get LAN IP for other devices. I mean, they have an app. I guess we can just download the app from the... From the... Pla... 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 Store? Pla... Store? Way too dank. Okay. Okay, I got you. In the planning stage? Got it, got it, got it. Um, okay. Give me your big dick. Dick paste. Give me your big dick, daddy. Let me, let me insert, in, import your dick in my asshole. <laughs> Does it need to be a streamer bot that opens FL? You can make it open FL Studio. Okay. Um, how? Do, let's see if we can recreate it doing the barrel roll stuff. Okay. Let's uh, let's go over to. How do we do it? First of all, let's look at my code of how I did it. Okay. How did I do it? Does anyone else have this problem where um, comments and streamer bot just go fucking everywhere? It doesn't keep the order. Does that ever happen to anyone? Can someone confirm? Because all of these comments are like out of out of order. Does that happen to anyone else? Anyway, execute code. What is this? What is this? How do we... Don't use comment and sub action, so no. Okay. Yeah, you can add comments, so you like know what stuff does. Okay. Um, let me add, because I... I'm not going to get into it, but basically the barrel roll thing that I do for my stream is like I dynamically add filters to my camera. So I actually don't, I'm not going to bother trying to do that in Sammy because it can't be fucked right now. So we're just going to add a new one. Move. Wait, shit. How are we going to do this? Do I feel like, do I feel like, no, let's do a simpler one. I don't feel like doing barrel roll. What's a really simple thing that we can re recreate? What is commenting? Lack of commenting is called job security. Oh yeah, yeah. That's smart. You know what, you know what's funny though? In my last job, I wrote their iPhone app. It's like an iPhone app for uh, service drivers. So they, it would like basically like tell them where to go and all the supplies they need when they do their service jobs. And like nobody else at the company knows how to like write iPhone apps. Um, and the code I wrote was super shit. Didn't save my job. <laughs> They're basically fucked now because they fired me and nobody else knows how to, <laughs> how any of my code works. 
<laughs> so yeah. What the fuck? You know how to make iPhone apps? I mean, I was forced to learn how to make it. I didn't say they were good, but yeah. Uh, I, I used Xcode, so I had to... I learned Swift. It wasn't the greatest code. But I, I learned a lot about, like, GPS tracking and everything. And, like, yeah. It was not a very poorly written program. The only documentation I want to see is this paycheck. <laughs> I have your touch fuzzy redeem and Sammy board, although that may sound vulgar, it's not. You guys want to touch fuzzies and they get dizzy? <laughs> <laughs> Looks like there's a small fire, maybe there is. Oh no, Nutty is tracking us with the nut deck. Dude, I think I'm gonna get banned from Twitch pretty soon. I keep on making references to smoking drugs and then I'm literally injecting myself live on stream as well. <laughs> <laughs> if you guys missed last stream, I literally was inject injecting drugs into my body twice and everyone saw it. No staff here, but there was staff here for the needle. I don't think having Twitch staff in your stream is that big of a deal, to be honest. Because I feel like most of the people that have the staff badge, they're not like police officers. They're just like dudes that like happen to work at Twitch, <laughs> but don't actually have power over whether to ban you or not. Because this one time uh, Majin Julio was in chat and I was straight up like, yo, I'm streaming to YouTube right now. Just like straight up. <laughs> they just happen to show up when you're doing questionable things though. Well, I'm just injecting drugs into my body. Oh, this is a good one. Jin to Lin. Let's see if I can import this. Thanks. Import. Oh, this is cool. Whoa, wait. You just gave me a great idea. You guys should give me code. And then I'll import them. No function. No release yet. Yes, no triggers value. Wait, what? Is this a deck? Is this a deck or is this a whole ass thing? Import. It didn't work. Did I do this wrong? Oh, there it is. Touch fuzzy scene. So, of course, this is only going to work for, like, I'm not going to be able to run any of this. Because, um, yeah, it's it's using, like, code that I don't have. But I can import stuff. Let me see. Do you guys have any... Does anyone here have any code that I can just import and run that doesn't require, like, any extra stuff? Is there anyone ha that has anything I can just try out? Let me see if I if I have something. I've got code for you, Daddy. I got code for you. <laughs> well, if you've got code in uh, Sammy set up, like if it's just a button, you can just can't you just do export JSON and just put it on Pastebin and give it to me? Like I want to import stuff that you guys have made. But as long as it doesn't require like files in my system or like anything set up in OBS, something like that. I know codes for the original Contra on NES. Yeah, isn't it like up, you know, something and then et cetera, et cetera. Here, welcome. Okay, here we go. Raw, import. Welcome. Okay, what is this? Chatter. Username. What does this do? Wait, what does this code do? Triggers. Okay. Change my channel. Yeah, again, this is like the just the things that I... So where, where, where do I even put that in? Here? I'm assuming here. Is there any anywhere else I have to change it? I know it seems like I'm just like a fucking, I'm yelling at the clouds again, yelling at cloud strife again. I'd really prefer if I didn't have to change stuff like this. It's just my feedback. I don't know if you guys are developers, maybe you can use my feedback or you can just be like, fuck you nutty. <laughs> Your feedback sucks. Fuck out of here. I can. Ooh, there we go. 
So wait. Hmm. So what what's happening here? So if are you welcoming everyone that's new to the channel? Is that what's happening? Check false. Welcome to the stream. What if I type something in? Balls. And if I type something again. Ah, so like the first time you write something in chat, it'll like welcome you. He's, here's the barrel roll. Does this one dynamically like add filters and stuff? Or is it something I need my OBS things for? Delete button. Standby. Yeah, so this I'm gonna actually need the PNG, I guess, right? Rotation angle, rotation source. Rotate source. Scene name. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I got you. I got you. This is gonna fuck up what my scene, isn't it? <laughs> Let's see. So this is where I put in the name of my scene and then the name of a source. Let's choose my camera. Rotate source, 360 degrees. Really? That's it? Variable transition? Okay. Save, save and close. Triggers. So there's no triggers for this. But theoretically, if I wanted to share this as a channel point reward with people, I, I could just put in like a thing for it, right? They'd have to change their channel point reward, but like, okay. I'm not going to bother doing that. Let's make it uh wait, let's just see if it works first. Whoa. <laughs> wait, it doesn't go back to zero at the end though. It doesn't go back to zero at the end. It should change it to zero, right? Maybe in your code, what you should do is at the end. Let me see. This is what I would do. Um, set rotate rotation. And I, I probably have a variable here for the scene name. Um, reaction. Camera A. Zero. Is that working? No? Thank you for that. Hold on a second. Is it not setting it to zero at the end? Save button. Yeah, is this not, is this wrong? I want to run it repeatedly. <laughs> I want to run it repeatedly. How come it? Aw, oh, man. I wanted it to run it repeatedly. Whoa! <laughs> hey! I'm gonna stop doing this feet thing, okay? This is the last time I'm doing it, okay? Because it's getting weird. It was only funny the first time, okay? Unless you guys really want to see my feet, okay? <laughs> Thanks, Security Live. Thanks for <laughs> Thanks for the tier 3 sub for 20 months. You and Dave do tier 3 subs like every month. It's not even just like a one it's not even like a one time thing. You do it every month. Wait, why doesn't it why doesn't it change it? Wiki feet. This is cool. Let me see, how do I make variables? Variables, set local variable. You know what would be cool? If you could, and I don't know how you would do this, but you could like have some kind of variable, but you can make the variable thing here. Instead of you having to type it in here, you can make the variable like a scene, a, a dropdown, right? So that I could easily change the variable to like a scene name by clicking. I don't know how you would do that, but that would be pretty pog. 
You guys want to hear my idea for something? It's it's Sammy could use it too, but I'll I'll use streamer button as, as an example because I'm more familiar with it. You want to know what what my idea is, chat? I don't think Nate is gonna put this in. I think the amount of work is like probably too much. You guys want to know what my idea is? Say yes, okay? So I know that you guys are listening. <laughs> that body's welcoming himself. What a loser. Okay. This is quite nerdy, but it could be very helpful to you guys, I think, okay? Yeah, no, we don't want to hear it. Nah, fuck out of here, nutty. We don't want to hear your bullshit. <laughs> uh, okay, I got it. That's cool, Jin. I'll have a look at that in a second. So this is what I uh, what I this is what I think would be really cool in streamer bot, and I don't know how they would do it. Again, Sammy could do the same thing. What I would love is the ability to create your own custom action, custom sub actions. What do I mean by that? So at the moment. We go to Twitch, there's no way to create a poll. You can't create a prediction. They don't have something like that. And we could just wait for the developers to just like add in their own option. But I think it would be cool if you could like create your own function kind of thing, your own function. So for example, I have this poll template, right? And you have to go in and you have to edit each of these sub actions, right? duration right but it'd be cool if i could turn this whole thing into its own function where it has its own text box and then i get to specify like what each of the text box things is let me let me show you an example right like some kind of way to build up your own thingy and there'll be like a window as bit that's like Poll question, okay? This will be like whatever the poll is. And then I can specify that I want this to be like a drop down box for scenes or or just free text or something. And then we can say the next one is a duration field and then I can specify and say like, hey, I want this to be a number, right? So they're like a dynamic actions kind of thing. And then that way I can like define my own thingy here inside of the program. And then I can go into any other action, right? And then I could right click and be like, yeah, I want to use this thing. And it like has its own window and I can just populate the window there. You know, does that make sense? We have something like that. Yeah, well, I didn't know that. <laughs> How do I do that then? How do I do that? That's what I want. So I could like literally just build my own thing here. Um, I'll give you, I'll give you another example, right? If you, um, if you've downloaded some of my code that I've given on Patreon, right? An example would be something like this. Like I, I make this thing here and then you have to type in like the name of your source, but it would be cool if I could just make my own thingy here where I can specify that I want this to be a scene dropdown box or a source dropdown box or something. You know what I'm saying? Not not mean, son. Wait for user input and wait for user choice. Wait, the fuck does that mean? Wow, that's a cool sub. <laughs> Yo, thanks, Eka Plays. Thanks for the sub for 17 months. Dude, it's flipping my camera around. I don't want it to do that. <gasps> Not as advanced what you want, but it's a start. Yeah, it's kind of like what's what what's their face said. Seems like some kind of dev kit for a streamer bot or whatever, like a map maker program along with a game. It's yeah, it's kind of like that. It's th that would be very that would require a lot of work to put in. So I, I would understand Nate's not wanting to put that in because it would require, but it would make it like really imagine the, imagine the kind of things that the community could develop. You know what I mean? 
Imagine the kind of things that the community could, could develop for this if they made something like that. Just imagine. You can have Sammy pop up a dialogue, bo dialogue box asking for what you want. Yeah, but that's like... Uh, okay, hold up. Let's see. Let me see what that actually looks like in Sammy then. Instead of me being like, oh, but it can't do this. Let me actually try it. Okay, we're going to get rid of the welcome thing. Thanks for giving me that chat. Can I get rid of the sub thing too? And the pizza thing? No more pizza thing. Let's go from scratch. So you said wait for input. Wait for user input. Type in something, dude. Is that it? Oh. Cock. Oh, that's actually pretty cool. Wait, hold up. This isn't exactly what I wanted. That this is not exactly what I wanted. What is default text? What is this? What is this? What's the default text? Save variable as message. Right? What does default text do? Default in the pop up. Oh. Um, marker created. Okay. This is my idea, right? Then we can do marker. This is not exactly what I wanted, but we'll go back. Sorry, we were talking about markers earlier and then I stopped talking about it. <laughs> uh, we can do login name, my name, description. And I want the description to be, how do I do variables again in Sammy? What's, what's a variable again? Is it, is it dollar sign or is it percentage? Slash dollar sign? Like both sides? Like this or just one side? Wait, wait, what, wait, whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> oh, wait, wait, what? Okay. Gotcha. Message. So if I did something like this, right? And then I can go edit triggers, message, wait, chat, Twitch chat. Message will be marker, only the broadcaster. So only I can do this and then save. So if I've done this correctly, again, this is not exactly what I wanted. We're going to change it, but I, this, is just, this is just a good example, right? Let's say I want to create a marker, right? They'd be like, yeah, I want to create a marker. We were just done talking about, uh, foreplay, right? So you can go marker, then it should pop up and ask me, okay, it didn't work. Fuck. <laughs> It didn't work. Why didn't that work? Did I type that in wrong? Welcome back, LDH. Save board? Man, should really be able to just save without closing. Just to... Okay, we can say save board. Uh, sorry. <laughs> you can say marker. Then I can type in what I want the marker to say. This is when we... Talked about foreplay, right? And then we're done. And so now, ideally, I'd want it to actually make a conf confirmation confirmation message in chat. But now, if I was to go back into my highlighter for my VOD, look right here. This is when we talked about foreplay. We didn't, but I'm just like pretending that we did. It creates that marker there. That's really cool. That's a really cool idea. The wait for user input. I don't exactly know what I would use it for, but that's just one example I, I thought of. Change order marker first. No, the marker comes second. What do you mean? Why would the marker come first? The marker has to, you have to say 
the input you have to wait for the input first and then and then, what do you mean yeah we could do it for polls that would be i guess i guess you could make it for polls as well yeah i, I guess you can do that i mean like if you're if you're typing in twitch chat right if you're typing in twitch chat you can just like I understand what you're saying. If you're typing in Twitch chat, you can just ty type slash poll anyway, and then you, um, wait, where is it? Slash poll. You can type this message and then this comes up, but I also understand people like me, we don't use the Twitch chat. We use things like Chatterino and you can't create a poll from within Chatterino. So potentially you could make something where it's like poll, right? And then a window will pop up and then I can fill out the, what the question will be, which would be pretty cool. I think that's a pretty cool implementation of this. So you can run polls from like Chatterino. You know? Fuck me. Sorry. <laughs> you guys understand what I'm saying? No? Does that make sense to anyone? Here, I'll show you what I mean. Type in a question. I'll just make it so you guys know what I mean, okay? I'll make it. I'll literally, literally just make it for you guys now. So you're like, you know, um, option. Wait, how many options? Num options. Right. I'm not going to do checks, but like, we're just going to ignore just for the sake of making this easy, quick to like make, we're just going to put two options, even if we write like five. Okay. You can probably like write in code to like check what the value is here. And then like that determines how many times you run the next thing. Like just pretend that we did that. I'm not going to bother doing that right now. Pretend all right, option one, option two, and then we can do something like this. Create a poll. Create a poll. Login will be nutty. Poll name will be poll question. And then this will be Option one, option two. And then we can have, we could have more questions for like duration and well as well. We're not gonna worry about that. But if I did this right, fatal error. <laughs> fatal error. <laughs> Amazing. Well, that happened. Fuck, you're gonna do all that again? I didn't do it right? What, what did I do wrong that time? Okay, let me do that again. Let me type all of that. Pull. Type in a question. Blue cheese, of course. Hit us with that blue cheese. How many options? You know, I'm going to skip this question. We don't even need this one. Fuck it. We're going to use the word choice this time. Not that it matters. Choice one, choice two, choice, okay. And then we go Twitch. Don't fail on me again, bitch. <laughs> um, Twitch, create poll, nutty. Poll question. Oh wait, I'm doing, sorry. Poll question. Choice one. 
choice to 60 second poll. Um, why is the poll running again? What the hell? Save and close. Okay, didn't crash that time. So now we're gonna set up the trigger will be exclamation mark poll. Only I can run this. All right, now check this out, chat. I don't know if it's gonna work. Check this out, you guys ready? You type out your username and it caused a fatal error. Is that really what happened? But it didn't crash that time. Anyway, I don't, whatever. All right, check this out. You guys ready for this? Hide poll. You guys ready for this? I don't know if this is gonna work. Poll. Type in a question. Do you like pizza? I can't just press enter. Hide poll. I can't just press enter. Okay. Yes. No. That's pretty nice. That's pretty nice. So if you want to like uh, quickly create a poll from Twitch chat and you don't use some, if you, if you're not typing directly into, into, um, what's it called? Like you don't use that. If you use something like Chatterino, cause you can't, you can't create a poll from Chatterino, right? You can do something like that where you type in poll and it'll, it'll actually prompt you to like type in what your questions are. I actually like, really like that a lot. Now, now that, now that I've seen that, I actually want something like that in stream or what? <laughs> That's pretty awesome. Are you gonna switch back? No, I'm not switching back. I'm sticking with streamer bot. But I'm just like, I want to be more educated and aware about like the kind of things that Sammy can do. So when people like ask me like, oh, like which one should I use? I can tell you guys with confidence, like, well, here are some nice things that Sammy can do. And there are like, in fairness, there's a lot of things about Sammy that I really like that I wish streamer bot had. But just like streamer bot works more for what I need. And I, I can't be bothered moving all my shit over either. <laughs> you know, if the input pop-up could include autofill that uh, help help for OBS scenes and such, that would be huge. I think there's a lot of things. This, this has a lot of potential. What would you guys, okay, guys. What would you use a wait for user input for? Like, what would you, what would you do with it? This is pretty poggers. Oh, you know what's even better? You know what's even better about this? Because now that I've made it, check this out. Export JSON. Now that I've made it, check this out. Guys, get your Sammy's open, okay? Go get your Sammy, open up your Sammy, everyone. Boom, done. There you go. Go get your Sammy guy. Import import that. You guys now have the, the code I just made. Go get it. Copy copy that text, then go import from JSON and you're done. And then you have the exact thing I made. And you can you can do the same thing. You don't need to touch anything. You import that, just type in poll in your in your stream. Well, you will have to change this. I lied. You will have to change your name here. Um but it should work. Update Twitch game title. Yeah. Actually, that's a good idea. That's a really good idea. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm trying to think of things that like the native Twitch chat can't do though. Cause I'm pretty sure you can just do that from Twitch chat, can't you? I'm trying to think of things. I also need a P. I need to check the link I posted. No, I'm ignoring everything you say because I've done that a lot tonight, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> what is this? Sammy Core. Was it porn? Hi and welcome to the Pokemon and Friends Classic Installer. This installer will make sure everything will be installed the proper way. First of many questions, are you migrating from Leoran Board 1? Fair. 
villain. Ah, fuck, this is Pog. Okay, I got it. <laughs> okay, I got you. Okay. This is this is pretty cool. Again, I'm not going to use this. <laughs> I, it's going to take a lot for me to switch over to Sammy from uh, Streamer Bot. It's going to take a lot, but a lot of the stuff that I've seen today is like really compelling. Because there's a lot of stuff here that I really like. Honestly, though, the ability to write C-sharp code is like huge for me. Mostly because I, that's the language I know the most. Which is like my fault as a programmer. Like I'm probably, I'm probably, probably is just as easy to do like in another language that I just, I'm too stupid to know. But like, um, this is, this is good. I PM'd you a button JSON. Okay, hold up. Is this porn? Any, any tentacles in this? Any tentacles in this one? Let me see. What does this one do? Import. Okay, what is... I'm not even going to look at what this does. Triggers. So there's no triggers. Let's just... I'm not even going to see what it does. Let's just run it. No? What does this do? What? Did, wait, what did this do? <laughs> Streamer doesn't know. Fuck me, too. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> Wait, really? <laughs> okay. <laughs> that was pretty good. Yeah, there you go. Can you also easily export entire decks so people can just import them all in a button? Yeah, that's what I was talking about. You can just, uh, it's not very intuitive, but if you right click, go copy deck, um, it copies the JSON to uh, your clipboard. And then you could just go into paste bin, paste it all there, create the paste, and then just give it to people, which I think is amazing. Because like, it's not even just that you can export an entire deck. Like I don't have to go through this whole thing like like you do in StreamerBot, where if I export code, I have to like manually check off all of the stuff that I want to export. And even then, even if I do this, um, like I have to manually check off all these things and I have to check off any commands if I use commands. And then like it, even if I do all of that, it's not going to export all of the um, triggers for anything. Like none of that's going to be included in export. Um, so the person on the other end is going to have to import it. Then they're going to have to fix up. Um, they're going to have to like link all of the new actions to each of these things. And then like what happens if they're already using a follower alert, for example. Then they have to like this way. It's way more complicated in, in streamer bot um, compared to like Sammy. Where, like I can just give people a deck. If people like the way that I do do stuff i can just like export the deck give it to someone of course you're still gonna have to give them like the obs files if it like links up to the ob to obs and then you're still gonna have to give like any local files it uses but as far as like the actual like stream automation part of it you can just collapse it into like a single thing that you can give to someone which is awesome i actually like this is the biggest thing that i like about sammy also i need to pee yeah and you go P, yeah? Can maybe Twitter thread with all these pastebin links like the one you did for OBS plugins was Poggers? Which one? The OBS plugins? The ability to search plugins? Like, plugin uh, move? Like this one? Is that what you're talking about? That was done in StreamerBot. I can just give that to you straight up. It's, it's, it's all in my GitHub. Also, I need to, like, P. Can I go P? Am I gonna get in trouble if you? Are you guys you guys good? Yeah. Can I go pee? Okay. Thanks. Bye. I'm gonna go pee. I'll be back. Go count Pokemon. Yeah, I'll be back.
I just put all my penis juices all over my mouse. <clears throat> I put my penis juices all over my mouse. Uh oh, smoke! Naughty streams on fire. I'm gonna turn the heat on. I'm cool. I got penis juices all over my hands and I didn't and I'm rubbing it all over my electronics right now Hey, what do you guys say while I was gone? Who won? Hello, Dara Elite. Why don't you Dara lick my balls? <laughs> Maybe the inputs can set variables to make installing actions easy first action in a deck is set up and it sets up channel name and camera scenes, etc. Then all the other buttons use those variables. Yeah, you could do that. I mean, that's an option. Um, what else do I want to test with this? You guys have any other ideas? Why don't we look into some extensions we we look at? You won. Congratulations. The one in one up. Is for one uh you one yeah number one possibilities are endless um <clears throat> let's go and do bridge install an extension download extensions Christina's extension stream up tips let's look at the official extensions yeah Cause now that we've like looked at like streamer bot and what it can do, I have a, I have a rough idea of like the things I like about uh Sam. Did I say streamer bot? Fuck me, do I keep saying streamer bot? Don't I? <laughs> um, I have a rough idea of the things I like about Sammy and the things I don't like. Let's just see the stuff that the community has made. So let's have a look. Discord webhook. I actually did some research on how to do this in streamer bot. One of the things releasing on Patreon is like some simple code I have for like Discord webhooks. It's actually really easy to do. Um, it's all good, Nutty. I'm getting used to Sammy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I made a thing in... Um, it's not like a huge deal. Hands up in chat. And this is my way of farming engagement out of you guys. By asking you guys a question and forcing you guys to answer it. How many of you in chat would like a feature in like streamer bot or whatever to be able to like take a screenshot and automatically post that to discord how many of you would, as would like something like that can you fucking answer me or what <laughs> credit roll i already have that feature in streamer bot yeah I was doing some experimenting. People have already done that, right? This was just my version of it. A very simple version of it that I made. Oop. Oh wait, this is the wrong one. <laughs> Sorry, that's the wrong one. Wait a second. I made some simple code so you guys can like screenshot shit. So this is a source in OBS in the top left. And then I have it screenshotting to Discord. Um, anyway, the point is, it seems like they already have that in the community for, uh, for Sammy. So if you go here, Discord webhook, let's have a look at this. Setup. We recommend Ren I uh, can't even read. We recommend using WebSockets 4.9, which I'm using. Inside Sammy, go to bridge, install extension, it select the extension file. Done. Okay, so let's download. Coffee. Get now. Enter zero. I'm 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 uh, selfish, so I'm going to contribute $0 to this. 
Zero. Check out. Okay. I'll do this then. E Gmail. Okay, I got it. New content. Okay. So what what is an SEF? Is that Sammy? What do I need? Is Sammy the same thing? Is just a different extension? Is there a way to have Streamerbot interact with my Discord bot that I made? Uh depends on what kind of kind of inter interaction you mean. Sammy extension file. I was literally going to say streamer bot extension file. Okay, so imported that. Uh, then we're going to go Sammy de no bridge. Install an extension. Done. Thank you for downloading and install installing this extension. If you have any questions, go fuck. Uh, feel free to join my Discord. Uh, I'm good for now. Discord example deck. Okay, how to create a webhook. So I already know how to do that. Sending a message, sending a source screenshot, sending embeds to Discord. Let's do this one. Sending a source screenshot. Ooh, I like that you can have a big ass comment like this. Like a big ass one. Damn, I actually really wish you could do that in streamer bot. There's a lot of stuff I'm feel I'm I find myself saying that a lot about this. I wish I could do that in streamer bot because you can't you can put comments in streamer bot, but you can only put these tiny ass lines here. You can't put like big ass unless I'm stupid. Can you put like line breaks in streamer bot, guys? Is there a way? Is there a way you can put line breaks in comments? Or streamer bot? Is that a thing you can do? No? Sammy extension file. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the FAQ I want. Yeah. You know? Okay. Uh, enter your web socket password. So you got your webhook URL. Uh... WebSocket password? Wait, what? Oh, my OBS WebSocket password, right? Source name. Okay, hold up. I'm going to do this off st stream. So I don't know what my password is. Just kidding, I know what it is. WebSocket password. Need to get my webhook URL. I made a Q button for you and your chat to play with. Would you like to have it? Sure, share it with chat. Um, let me just quickly make a... Where is it? Edit channel, integrations, webhooks. Wait, what? Dino bot. Get out of your dino. Wait, hold up. Hold up. Hold, hold the phone, okay? I'm trying to do shit. Love your videos are literally on YouTube and I realize you're alive. Hello, welcome. Oh man, I think we were waiting for a rich, like, all night, right, guys? We're like, damn, where's Rich at? Rich, where are you, Rich? <laughs> um, chat, how do I use this? This source name here? How come there's nothing in here? How do I, how do I do that? Source name? Is that source name? So we just have to type it in. Damn. Okay. Camera A. It made it seem like I could just click the drop down. Yeah, if you're coming from YouTube, Rich, we're currently looking at a program called Sammy. I don't know how much you know about what I do on YouTube. So, 
We're trying out this thing called Sammy for the first time. Well, file path, the full file path where you want to save the picture must include PNG at the end. Uh, okay. What's a YouTube's streamer? Streamer, what's that? Hello, Cyanide Sugar. Might have to restart Sammy for the OBS stuff to connect, possibly. Should I share what my WebSocket password is? <laughs> this is not a secure field here. So if I type it in, it's plain text. There should probably be some, like a secure field. Yeah, yeah, yeah. P A S S W O R D. Yeah, well. <laughs> okay, let me just uh, get a directory. You know what I, what I hate about computers is file paths. I never know whether to use a forward slash or a backslash. Does anyone else feel that way? Naughty, we don't give a shit, okay? Just do stuff. Is it forward slash or backslash? Like, what do I... What? Do, which one is it? Wait, what is this? You can use global to get the root. Okay, that's fine. We'll just keep it at... We'll, we won't even change this then. <laughs> It doesn't matter. It just said that, right? Where? It doesn't matter if you use slash or... Okay, well, that's not fair, okay? You know how to read and I don't, okay? It's not fair. You can't do that. Okay, I'm going to put in my WebSocket password. And then I guess we're going to save it. And um, I'll add a trigger to it so I don't reveal my password. We'll go triggers. We'll have this tri trigger from a screenshot and only I can redeem it. Save. So let's see if it works. Let me open up... Um, Here's the Discord page here. Yeah? When I was testing stuff. So if I type in... Oops. If I type in... Screenshot... Does it work? I probably did something wrong. I'm sure I did something wrong. 100% I did something wrong. I'll look at it in a second, Landy. Save? Fuck me, okay? It didn't work. What did I do wrong? Did I not enter in all the informations? Did it at least take the screenshot? Did it at least take the screenshot? Screenshot. Image. It didn't even take the screenshot. Something probably. What did I what did I do wrong? Okay, guys, I'm gonna show the start of my WebSocket password. Okay, it doesn't it doesn't matter, right? It doesn't matter if I show my password. It's not even the full password. Okay, it's like not even half of it. Wait, fuck it. Okay, I don't care. Yeah, whatever. Who cares? What well, what's the worst you're gonna do? You're gonna control my stream? You guys can do that already anyway. Yeah. <laughs> you guys can already do that. Who gives a fuck, okay? So this is what I did. Here's my WebSocket uh, URL. My web webhook URL. Yeah? But like, what did, what did I do wrong? Did I do something wrong here? Wrap it in quotes? You son of a... <gasps> it 
It worked. Look at that. Look at that, chat. Why are there red bubbles here? What's my what's this red bubble for? Oh, okay. There we go. Um Well it worked. Okay, that's actually fucking nutty. Okay. I wish someone was fucking nutty. <laughs> All right, let's do it again. <laughs> Yay! There you go. It works. Done. There we go. It takes the screenshot right to Discord. Wow, Miss, I'm not a genius. I'm literally using code other people wrote. Although I, I did the same thing in streamer, but I hope the Q button works. All right, here's have a good day, Landy. Let me let me import your thing. See what it does. Fuck, you gonna you gonna hack my computer? You gonna hack into my computer again? Q, what does this do? Nutty, look here. Set the channel name for a button to send messages to. Messages to. Okay. Q start. Starts the Q. Stops the Q. Lists the Q in chat. Draws a user. Moves from the Q. Announces them in chat. Join. When a Q is started, users can join. Ooh, okay. This is pretty useful. Q start. Okay. We're going to try this out. Sorry, we're gonna try this out now. I'm gonna type in Q start. Fuck, it didn't work. Set set the channel name. Did I do it wrong? Triggers. Did I do it wrong? It doesn't say anything. Save the deck. Fuck me, dude. Why do I have to always save the deck, okay? <laughs> Son of a... Okay, there we go. All right, type in join. You're in. You're in. You're in. Edit commands. Q list. Okay. Q list. Users in queue, and then what if I'm like queue draw? All right, step on up. Rich is here gaming. Wait, what? He wasn't the first one that joined the chat, was he? Joined the joined the queue rather, was he? I thought it was Landy. Why did it pick Rich first? Was it like a random person? Why, why rich? Yeah, is it a random one? It should be random. Oh, okay, it's supposed to be random. Gotcha. I was thinking this would be more of like a, you know, playing with viewers kind of queue. Like, all right, guys, we're going to queue up so you can play games with me kind of thing. No, that that's fine. I just, I, I just want to know what it did. So... I guess it pulls them out of the queue. There isn't an active queue. Bullshit, yes there is. I made this in five minutes. Nutty, bear with me. No, you're good. I'm just, I just, uh, it's just a ex good example of something that you can do in uh, Sammy. I was gonna say streamer bot. It's pretty good for five minutes. I'm forever lost in the queue. Yeah, well, I'm forever lost in your eyes. How about that, yeah? You ever think about that? The queue chooses who gets to ro Shambo. Does it remove the user from the list? Um, whoever's in the list... Wait, let me just draw. I'll just keep drawing. Yeah, it does. It does pull you out. Damn smooth. 
<laughs> I'm lost in your eyes. No, like seriously, where the fuck am I? <laughs> Q chooses who will be sacrificed. Yeah, this is nice. I, I think um it seems that Sammy is a lot more robust than streamer bot in terms of like the stuff it can do. It's just that streamer bot has C sharp. Like you can do custom C sharp code, which is like everything to me. <laughs> I've been looking for this exactly in streamer bot. I mean, like I said, realistically, everything you can do in this, you could probably do in streamer bot and vice versa. It's more about like how it's done kind of thing. Um, and some things I really like in Sammy a lot more than streamer bot. My Landy, thanks for hanging out. Thanks for hanging out. Yeah, it's just about what, what you prefer. But uh, this has come a long way. Can I resize the window? <gasps> you can. Do you guys remember the days of Leoran board where you couldn't even resize the window? Oh, wait. I saw this option, minimize to tray. That's not to tray. Is it when I close it? There we go. Poggers. It's very pog. Stop that. Stop. Stop doing that. <laughs> okay. Um. Cool. Cool. What else can we try? We can back everything up. Like like a like a like a Tonka truck, you know? Ba back that up like a Tonka truck, you know what I'm saying, chat? You can create create source. F really I can create create source? That I can really do that? Create source. Um create scene. Source commands, create source, source, balls, source type, wasapi. I want to make wasapi. You can't do things like, um, like a source mirror. That's not a thing you can do. Can I like you type in something? Oh, I can. So if I wanted to do a stream effect source mirror, I just have to figure out what the name is. I could do that. Browser source, scene name, settings, settings JSON. Okay, this is kind of cool. Can I just like test this? Is it going to work? Okay, this didn't work. Scene name. I can't just like put in the current scene. I have to actually type it in. It didn't work. I'm sure there's something else I need to do. I'll figure this out later. Can can you make Sammy action to load from streamer bot import text? Nope. You can't do that. You can go to variable viewer. What do you mean? Do what do you mean? What am I doing here? <laughs> create source. You can create source. I don't know what what accent that is. I don't know. I think I'm like. I don't know what else to try out. Is there anything else in the Sammy thingy that I can I can try? Any more extensions they have that are pog pogaronis? Are there any more extensions that are poggers? Let me close all this. I think it was Mario. Poggers. Uh, Sammy Dick. 
breach official extensions yeah what else is in here custom point chatbot for youtube and twitch cool catching gym battles and pvp battles for eight regions uber duck ai speech synthesis Generate natural sounding speech with ease. With UberDuck AI, anyone can make their tal their sorry, their alerts, donations, automated text readouts sound natural. Okay. Setup. You can find the setup guide here. Cool. Download. Do LB2 files work with the other thing? <laughs> Sorry, there's too many freaking names for things now. What a cool name, UberDuck. You know what UberDuck is, Twix? You know what UberDuck is? Quack, quack. Bridge, install an extension. Uber, UberDuck. I, I installed it. Now what? Okay. Balls. Balls. They are compatible. Compatible? You speak in Spanish to me? Extensions. Sammy Bridge. Uber Duck Speak. Whoa. Why is the window so small? I can't see shit. <laughs> Voice. Scout. What? It doesn't speak. I didn't hear anything. Am I supposed to hear stuff? Was I supposed to hear stuff? Did you guys hear anything? I'm high. Did I do it wrong? Hold up. Yeah, my headphones are working for sure. I want I want to hear the Uber duck. Extension has a readme, so I'm guessing you have to set up API keys. Oh yeah. You know what a smart person would have done is read the you know what? Sign up and log into Uber Duck, generate an API uh, key in secret. Copy paste it into the Uber Duck AI settings in the transmitter. Oh. Okay. So it's I gotta do it in this thing, right? Uber Duck AI API key and secret. All right, I'm going to go do this. I want you guys to be able to see stuff. Continue with email. All right, give me a moment, chat. I need to make an account. Talk to talks amongst yourselves or something like that. What? Sign up. Choose a username. Nutty. Username taken. Nutty Lamau. Done. Done. Sign up with email. Create an account. Okay. Account created. That extension had a, rede a re read me, so I am guess. Oh, I just read that. Oh, you need to go somewhere, Silverlink. Oh, Rody, Rody, are you a you a Sammy person? You a Sammy person too? How many Sammy people do we have in chat? <laughs> How many Sammy people have are, are here? Welcome to Uber Doug. I'm trying to get my Uber duck, okay? Pricing plans for every duck. 2,000 plus voices, throttled API access. Continue. Okay. Okay. Oh man, can I build Uber duck into my stream? That'd be pimp, actually. Fuck, did I just reveal my key? I didn't, did I? <laughs> Give your API key a name. Sammy.
Okay. All right. I got my key. Just chatting. Okay. I'm gonna have to import or oh no, I can show. Wait. Key. Secret. Okay. I think we're done. I think. I think that's it. Can we can we do our Uber Duck voices now? Is it gonna work? Show and s connect it. Okay. I think your background is on fire. I see smoke. Yep. Wait, how come I don't hear anything? I pasted stuff. Did I do it wrong? Oh no. <laughs> here's here's my Uber Duck stuff, right? Now what? And Cuba something. Did I save the board? I did. I did all that. How do I actually use it? Do I actually just type stuff in here? I want you guys to do, use my Uber duck. I want you guys to use my Uber duck. Oh, Stubbs McGee. Scout variable. Spy. How come there's only three voices here as well? Let me just delete the button and we'll just do it again. I mean, that's probably a horrible thing I just did. Install, in, install extension. Yeah. Button. Extensions. Sammy Bridge. Uber Duck. I don't hear shit. Unique name of a voice model to use can be manually typed in the voice model must exist or else the request will fail. Man, did I do this shit wrong? I don't know what I'm doing. I just want my Uber duck to speak to me, you know? Check the Uber box. Uber duck AI speak. Check the box. What about it? I want pizza. I've been making pizza references all night tonight. I think I just really want some pizza. I haven't had pizza in like months. Actually, that's not true. I had pizza last week. <laughs> How am I liking Sammy? It's pretty good. Um, there's a lot of stuff that I like about it. I'm ultimately still going to use streamer bot, but um, I can't lie, there's a lot of nice stuff that I really wish Streamerbot had. <laughs> Am I getting other sounds from it? How do I even know? How do I make Sammy make sounds? Because it's probably working, I probably just can't hear it. I just wanted to make sounds. Sounds device page? You mean in Windows or like this shit? Interface scale. Holy. So this is if you're like, um, this is like, if you've got eyes like a hawk. I don't know what I did wrong. Does StreamerBot work with WebSockets 5? It does not, no. It will, but it doesn't at the moment. I want my Uber Duck, guys. <laughs> I just want to use my Uber Duck. Somebody asked me about Uber Duck the other day. Do you guys know what Uber Duck is? Do I just keep saying Uber Duck and you guys are like, what the fuck are you talking about? 
You guys even know what it is? You want me to show you? I went quiet all of a sudden because I was trying to do something and then it was didn't work. <laughs> Hold up. Give me a phrase to say. Imagine I was Goku, okay? What would, what's something Goku would say? I want pizza. <laughs> I want pizza. <laughs> I want pizza. 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 <laughs> so I was trying to I was trying to get the voice to do that. What's reference audio? I want pizza. Maybe a pitch correction? What is this? I want pizza. I want pizza. You're just an overgrown that thing. Wait, what? I don't know what that sentence means. What is this? Oh, reference monster? Come here, you little jerk. What is this? Like, come here, you little jerk, and taste the back of my palm. But you ain't my daddy. No, nah, but I'm doing your mom. What the fuck is that? I just want these voices in my stream. Frieza. Let's get Frieza. Dragon. No, what the hell? Wait, where's Dragon Ball? What happened to the wait? What the fuck? I had it here before. Was it not here? Okay, let's do Monop. Oh my god, can we do the Monopoly Man? What is the what does Monopoly Man even sound like? You guys ready? You ready for this chat? You're just an overgrown that thing Chichi keeps in her drawer. <laughs> That's pretty good. You're just an overgrown that thing Chichi keeps in her drawer. How do I, so how would I use that voice and do I just copy this name? But like how do I I want to use this. Wait, hold up. I just, I can't, I can't hear it. I don't know if it's even doing anything. That definitely sounded like Goku. What are you talking about? Space is big. Really big. Dragon Ball. Goku. Oh my god. Synthesize. Synthesize, damn it. It's gonna be Pog, yeah? Uh, you need a longer You're sentence. Just an overgrown that thing Chichi keeps in her drawer. Okay, that's definitely supposed to be Frieza. <laughs> Solar Flare! <sighs> I chose Frieza? Why did it do. <laughs> You're just an overgrown that thing Chica keeps in her drawer. <laughs> That's actually okay. It's not bad. It's not bad. You're just an overgrown that thing Chica keeps in her drawer. <laughs> Chicha. <laughs> Chicha keeps. <laughs> you 
you're just an overgrown that thing Chica keeps in her drawer. But anyway, like, so how do I make it? Do you guys know what I'm doing wrong here? I don't even know what soldier is. I don't even know what that is. Because that would be cool if we could, like, we could have a channel point reward where you guys can speak in Goku's voice. That would be pretty cool. What was his website? It's uberduck.ai. Uberduck.ai. It has, like, a ton of voices. And apparently you can make it work with Sammy. Which means you can make it work with uh, StreamerBot as well. I'm sure that Mario's in here. I'm sure it has to be in here. Right? I actually don't know. Super... Super Mario. Oh my god, can we be Waluigi? Where's Waluigi, please? Oh my god, they have Flood! Oh wait, no, I already knew that they have Flood. Wait, where's Waluigi? What's something really dark we can say is Waluigi's voice? Everybody makes fun of my accent when all I want to do is become a... I'm going to spell it out phonetically. U.S. Citizen. <laughs> I love America. I love America. <laughs> Let's see what it sounds like. Everybody makes fun of my chin when I like it all. It's because you think you're a chicken. I know What the fuck was that? <laughs> what the fuck was that? <laughs> Everybody makes fun of my chin when I like it all. It's because you think you're a chicken. I know It started off so well for like the first half second and it just went off the rails. <laughs> I don't think you're gonna become a U.S. citizen that way. Everybody makes fun. Ah. Okay, let's choose a different one. All right, what about what about flood? Everybody, make sure to drink your water. And get hydrated. Is there a Kaiba? I look for Kaiba. Okay, I'll look for Kaiba in a second. Everybody, make sure to drink your water and get hydrated. Right. That sounds pretty good, actually. Everybody, make sure to drink your water and get hydrated. Right. <laughs> okay. We'll look up some Yu-Gi-Oh. Yeah, I just called it Yu-Gi-Oh. Seto Kaiba. Mmm. Yugi boy. Boy. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. 
Yugi boy. <laughs> oh, this is great. This is great. Um, wait, they have YouTubers. They do have Yoshi. <laughs> Oh my god, there's so many voices here. Oh my god, do they have... Who's the dude? Chills? You guys know who Oh my god, they have chills! You guys know who chills is? <laughs> you guys know who chills is? <laughs> Number five. Um... <laughs> Um, girl walks on water and nobody believes her. Okay. You guys know who Chills is? I don't know who Chills is either. I learned about Chills from this video, okay? Steamed hams, Chills. So apparently he's a dude that does like creepy like top five videos or something. And he sounds exactly like this. Well, Seymour, I made it. Despite your direction, ah, <laughs> Superintendent Chalmers, welcome. Actually, I, I should just you show you, like, Jill's... Uh. He actually sounds like that for real. That's a meme video. But he actually sounds Coming like that. In this video... <laughs> And when they investigated the tunnel under the bridge, this is what they found. <laughs> I feel like the dude, I feel like Chills is like, okay, anyway, let's see what it sounds like. Number five, under the bridge. <laughs> Number five, girl walks on water and nobody believes her. It's so good, dude. It's so good. <laughs> it actually sounds like him. Number five. Girl walks on water and nobody believes her. <laughs> Wait, let's let's do the first line of this video. Well, Seymour, I made it. Despite your direction. Ah, super. Well, Seymour, I made it, despite your directions. Let's see if it works. Guys, we need it. I'm, I'm having too much fun with UberDuck, but now I want it to work with my stream. <laughs> well, Seymour, I made it, despite your directions. <laughs> it's so accurate. All right. Someone said Yoshi. What other voices do you guys want? Guys, there's so many voices here. Imagine. We can make this work with my stream. I need to figure out how to make it work with the stream. By the way, before someone says, dude, nutty, find the TikTok girl voice, okay? Before anyone says that, before anyone says that, I, I got it, all right? Okay. Don't worry. I have something else. You'll find out later on. <clears throat> how about... Wait, Super Mario. Oh, how... You know how Yoshi goes... Hmm! How do we do that in text? Because <laughs> Yoshi doesn't speak. Hmm. You 100% know I'm just going to redeem Kaiba and make him say he loves me. <laughs> Holy shit, what is that? Um, hello, friends. It is me, your favorite dinosaur friend let's a uh, go oh wait that's what mario says oopsie daisy how do you spell daisy 
<laughs> Day Daisy? Is it Okay. What the fuck? Wait, what? Dude, it crashed. It literally just crashed. Holy, what the fuck is happening? <laughs> Wait a second. <laughs> hey, hold up. It's like he's speaking backwards but forwards somehow. <laughs> Hello friends. Has me just me family join us a friend or to go with you man what now you say. Whoa! Welcome, welcome Sammy devs. Hello. We are currently looking at Sammy. Um, so I'm sure that you guys know what all of this is about. I don't need to do any introduction about what Sammy is because you guys are Sammy. But welcome. We were currently trying to get Uber Duck AI working with Sammy and I don't know how to do that. So if anyone here wants to help me out and tell me what to do, I don't know how to make it work. <laughs> But welcome. I should probably just read the instructions. Um They yeah, they've they've heard of it. They've heard of it. Yeah, it's been going well so far. There's a lot of stuff that I like about it. Um If anyone wants to help me. Yo, someone set up Sammy, install this uh extension, the Uber Duck AI one, and then tell me how to, how it works, because I don't know how to get it to work. I already put my secret key and my API key. It's all here. I, I I put it in there. I don't know what to do though. Pros. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All the samey pros. Have a nice sausage so you can <laughs> glizzy yourself. Glizzy a homie. Did you refresh the bridge? Look, homie. I don't even know what the fuck that means. <laughs> uh, refresh the bridge. How do I do? What do I? How do? Who? who you know? What? <laughs> how do I refresh the bridge? I don't even know what that means. Refresh bridge. Do I? Do I? Do I do this? Refresh. Do that. Bridge is open. I got my Uber Duck AI installed. I did all that. Refresh. I did that. I got my Uber Duck AI. I got the thing in here. I got my I got my duck in there. I got my voice spy. I want pizza. Run. And then I don't hear stuff. So I just wanna I wanna know if this is like a uh, you I guess probably a user error, to be honest. <laughs> probably is a user error because I'm going to do what uh, what people who don't know what they're doing do, which is restart Sammy. It probably has nothing to do with anything, but I'm just going to do it anyway, because cause why not? What's in the tab on bridge uh, for Uber Duck AI? So it asked for my secret key, and I put it in. And I put the API key as well. I don't want to show it because it shows what my key is. You know what? I'm going to show it anyway. Who gives a shit, okay? So I got my secret key and my API key. Um, and then I have, and then I, and then I set up the, I set up an action here. So I called Uber duck AI speak. <clears throat> Uber, Uber duck AI speak. So I did that. And then, uh, and then I just pick a voice and it doesn't work. 
Do you have audio routing for capture capturing that bridge window? Uh it's just it's just a Chrome window, isn't it? <clears throat> is the is the audio supposed to come out of the Chrome window? Either way, I, I do hear my Chrome audio. I know that for sure because we have this great Steve Hames video that we're playing, and we can hear that. Well, Seymour, I made it despite. Does the checkbox by Uber Duck do anything? So the checkbox is just a thing for all actions. It's like, yeah, it's just like for like deleting stuff or whatever. It has nothing to do with the checkbox. It does for Christina's TTS extension, presuming Uber Duck AI does as well. Um. Can anyone try it out and let me know if it works for you? Try saving it as a variable. Cool. Save. Save and close. Save. Because you guys are like, Nutty, did you save it? Yeah, same thing. I didn't hear anything. <clears throat> Scout. It looked promising because I, I've... Uh, someone asked me a while back, like... How can I get Uber Duck AI work with, working with my stream? And I didn't really look into it too much, but it seems like if it can work with Sammy, then we can do a lot of amazing stuff, you know? What pops up in the variable viewer? Nothing. Oh, I'm reading the readme and it's really complicated. It's not that complicated, it says just do this. It just says do these steps. So I already did this. I got the key, put it, put in the transmitter, and then boom. Example. You know what? Let's get this example deck, yeah? Let's just get this example deck. Maybe the example deck has some cool stuff in it. Uber Duck Part 1. Hey there! Trigger. Hey, whoa. What the hell does this trigger thing do? Trigger button. Is that what I need to do? Is put a trigger thing? Is that what that does? What the hell does trigger... Oh, wait. ID3. What the hell is ID3? Trigger ID3. What the hell is ID3? ID4. What are these buttons? Where are these coming from? It has Star Fox 64 voices. What do you mean? I already have Star Fox 64 voices in my stream. What are you talking about? Here, let me take a really long time to set up my joke right now. <clears throat> let me take an obscenely long time to set up my joke to the point that it won't be funny anymore. Give me a second. We, all, we already have Star Fox voices in our stream. Look at me, I'm Fox McCloud, star of the, of the hit game, Star Fox. <clears throat> ID3 is probably a second Look button. at me, I'm Fox McCloud, star of the hit game, Star Fox. <laughs> You know? No, tell us say, oh, wow. Uh. Sorry, you guys were getting double audio. Look at the commands on the bottom button. Use Baiku, use Mix It Up, use Sammy, use Streamer But, use your own code, use hotkeys and zero automation, use drugs, use my body vigorously. Carry free bomb. <laughs> Sorry. I need to put this in aux two or aux one. One of those. There you go. Now you won't hear it. <clears throat> Naughty say I won't. That will give you a little insight on how. Wait, look at the bottom commands on the bottom button. Inside how it works. Test we. Okay. All right. How do you do this effect? Uh, I 
had to program it myself. So it looks like it's making a wave file, which I am not seeing anywhere. <clears throat> Text to speech. So like, what am I doing wrong? Is anyone, has anyone been able to set it up? The button also has triggers. Uber duck success. Extension trigger. Extension trigger. You have them, but you're looking at it. <clears throat> I'm, re I'm confused what this trigger is because you're like the ID4 is like none of these buttons. This is ID5, that's ID7, that's ID8, ID6. So I don't understand what this is this is about. None of these buttons are things that I have. I don't have an ID3. Confused. I'm confused beyond comprehension chat. Hmm. <laughs> Poorly written session as far as trigger buttons. Can someone just set it up and be like, yo, you're fucking up here, nutty. Here, here, and here. You're fucking up everywhere, okay? <laughs> Unless there's something else I need to add to this. Right? Was there anything I, I needed to add to that? I just want to say I like pizza. Uber duck ready. Trigger pull data. There's something else you need to add to that. Oh? You want to hit us with that knowledge? Do, do, de, ca, do de, ca, Devin? Whoa! Someone subbed an hour ago and I didn't read it. <laughs> Security live. I didn't read your sub from an hour ago. I'm so sorry. Thank you for the sub to Landy. And thank you, Comic Dads, for the sub for 15 months. Thank you. Thanks, guys. Thanks for giving me lots of money. Copious amounts of money, yeah? Thanks for the sub, Fred. What up? On Not on these nuts. I've been meaning to do something like this, but with Ranma, but it's so much work, I'm crying. That took me longer than anything I've ever made in my stream. <laughs> on days, 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 on days. Pays on day. Chocolate rain. Oh, what up, Binky? What's happening? Chocolate rain. I am in Australia. You are correct. 420. Whoa. 420, guys. Uh, smoke uh, weed, but responsibly, okay? And only if it's legal where you're at, okay? I don't want you guys to get in trouble, okay? And only, only if your health permits you to do that, okay? I move away from the mic to breathe. <laughs> uh, Aussies are cool. I don't know if I'm cool enough to be cool. Is it illegal where you're at? Uh, you know. Uh, legal is a matter of perspective, yeah? That's just, you know what I'm saying? It looks like Uber Doc generates WAV files like you saw, and that's why it needs to be the core's proxy since browsers can't load file URLs. So that means, okay, so you're telling me that I gotta change this shit. This course proxy, yeah? To what? Sorry, if you guys just got in the stream, you're like, Nutty, the fuck are you doing, homie? Um, 
for trying to get Uber Duck AI to work with my stream. Hello, Office Drummer. Thank you for the gifted sub to Bato Loco. Thank you very much. Naughty, what the fuck are you doing, homie? <laughs> I remember to say that in my court hearing next week. Yeah, it's a matter of perspective. And then everyone's like, he's got a point. <laughs> the judge is like, well, you know, he's uh, he makes a good point. You know, he's he may have he may have trafficked like. 20 tons of drugs over, but you know, it's a matter of perspective. <laughs> Shouldn't you be slandering slobs or something? Streamlabs OBS? More like Streamlabs bad. You know? What does the B stand for in Streamlabs OBS? Boo. You know? Damn vicious. Oh shit. <laughs> Thanks for all the educational content. When do we get the printer tutorial? Uh, early September. I'm not gonna, okay. <laughs> you guys are gonna hate me, okay? So the video, I, I have all the info I need to make the printer video, okay? And I could release a video at any time. I just have to make the video first for the printer video. However, last month I have this I have this deal with Skillshare where I have to do a video every month. Do a barrel roll. <laughs> Sub to win the game. I have to do I have to do a, a video for Skillshare every month. But last month's video, uh, which was July, they they. I got it approved and they're like, okay, you can publish the video now, but I published it on like the 1st of August and they were like, yo, homie, what the fuck? You were supposed to post it in July. I'm like, I mean, it's basically July, right? Is that a problem? And they're like, well, yeah, it has to be in July. So I'm like, oh shit. So now they're like, okay, so your video for August, you have to post that in like October now or something. So now I can't, I, if I want to do my Skillshare video, it has to be like, in September. I can't do it in August anymore because I technically have done my video for August. So I'm like, shit, now I gotta wait for that. <laughs> but also, like, I, I'm i very behind in my stuff that I need to... Like, I'm very behind in videos. So, like, I'm probably not even gonna have it ready by the end of August anyway. So just at the beginning... Let's just aim for the first week of September. We'll have the printer video. Done. I'm just in the no, middle that, of like, so many I things. notice your skin looks better already. Are the nope. shots working well so far? Nope, they're not going to take they effect. they are. They're not going to take into effect. They're not going to take into effect for like at least two months, and then four months is when it's going to clear up. So it doesn't work this quickly. Can I ask the streamer my question? You can. I don't know if I can answer it, but you can ask it. You have the Core's proxy PHP web page running on a web host somewhere? Uh, No. Wait, sorry. Wait, before I, before I answer anyone else's question, let me respond to the people that are trying to help me out first. Sorry, I got distracted. There's people trying to help me out. Let me just like answer those questions first. So we're trying to get this Uber Duck shit working. I didn't change this at all. Sorry, you guys can't see what I'm looking at. I didn't change this at all. This didn't change at all. Have you tried laser skin removal? Oh, dude, I never thought of that. Thanks. I've tried just peeling all your skin off like like an or you're an orange. Fuck, you guys are way smarter than me. <laughs> no, I started new drugs for my eczema. Woo! Drugs, guys! Hell yeah! I love drugs. And inject them in them inside of my body. So yeah, I, I have to take these injections now. So it's kinda like an insulin shot. So I have to, it's the first time I've ever had to inject myself with anything. So I was like really scared, but I did it. <laughs> I had my, I did my two first self injections uh, on Monday. So I have to do that every two weeks now. You need to download the course PHTP page and put that in a web page somewhere. 
if that default URL doesn't work. Okay, okay, okay. So where do I get that from? Cores proxy address used to bypass cores restriction on file origins. This should point at a trusted host and is required for operation. So where do I actually get this from? Uber Duck AI. Is it in releases? Source code? Like where where is it at? Desktop. Reaction. So this one here. So what do I have to do then? How do I what do I do with this shit? Okay, save this. Save link. Save me link. Cores. Okay. I got that there. Do I just like link? Do I link? Link. Hiya! Sorry, link. Um. So remember what? How could I make it so when someone redeems a channel point, it turns a filter on? But how do I make it after a couple seconds, it turns itself off? You add a delay and then you just add another filter to turn it off. Thank you, Reclining Gamer. Um, yeah, I'll answer your question in a second, Reclining Gamer. I just want to get this working first, but there are people trying to help me, so I like... So wait, so do I do like file, blah, blah, blah? What does it look like again? You can do file, and then I link it to like wherever the fuck it is on my computer, right? Am I, am I correct in, in that assumption? Yeah? You can't do file? Fuck me, dude. Then where the hell do I do it? That's why you need a cores proxy? Well, I don't know how the hell to set that up then. Why can't I just use this one? Why does this one not work? Is it because it's down? It has to be a web server somewhere. Well, I don't have that set up. It might be. Does it still work? I don't know. I'm, I'm guessing it doesn't. Just set up a server on your own PC, bro. Wamp. Is that... Is that wet, wet ass... Um... Um... Mother's... Pain uh, stuff. <laughs> Hello, reclining gamer. Thank you, Fred. Thank you for the gifted sub to Flipstream. Or install. I I wanted to go through all that effort. Do I have to go through all that effort now? Do I have to do all that right now? I don't feel like doing any of that. Yo. I am Curie B, your, your, uh, your waifu is this. This is your waifu. Yeah. Zamp is good too. Okay, fucking. We'll do WAMP, whatever the fuck this is. Start with WAMP server. Download. Crypto miner. 2000 okay that sounds pretty good i can't i don't want to have to do this this is too much effort it takes two minutes i don't have to deal with anything that's like put in your email again what's this zamp zamp p download pitch p pitch p Download. Okay. I'm downloading it. If this takes longer than two minutes, I'm banning everyone in chat. Okay. Everyone gets banned. The only person that won't get banned is caffeine. Okay. I don't know why I chose caffeine. It was just the first person I looked at in chat. Everyone but calf's getting banned. Okay. You'll be the last man on earth. Because you didn't activate it, blah, blah, blah. Okay, do I need to care about this? 
Do I need to care about this? Accept this ban like a man. Okay. All right. Uh, you've been hacked. Oh, shit. Thanks. Thanks, computer. I can't believe I've been hacked again. All right, now what do I do? Tell me, t tell me step by step, okay? What do I do with that? What did I just do? What did that do to my computer? I sent you a golden peen. Yeah, but dude, you sent me a golden penis and I'm like, how am I supposed to use this thing? It's too small. <laughs> How am I supposed to use this, man? It's too small. You know what I'm saying? Tell you step by step. Who are we? Nutty? Yeah. Oh, shit. Yeah. Yeah, you guys aren't me. Damn. You're right about that. If only, if only I knew that earlier. Okay, now what do I do? Wait, did that even do anything? I don't know if that even did anything. What did that do? What did that do? Apache friends. How do I install? Probably easy. Okay, I did it. And zip. And zip the blah, blah, blah. Now start the... I did all that. Unpacking files. I'll unpack your files, if you know what I mean. Okay, it's installing the, the stuff now. This is a lot of effort just to use UberDuck, guys. <laughs> I just want to use Uber Duck. I just want, I want to have Curse Yoshi talk to me. That's all. I just wanted to have Curse Yoshi talking at me. Who here was here? Who was here for Curse Yoshi? I want to have, I want to have this talk at me. No, but thank you. What? You don't like you don't like chills from top 15? Number 5. Girl walks on water and nobody believes her. <laughs> or this? Miyuki boy. Or this? You want like this one? Everybody makes fun. Ah, my chin. When I get dog is because you are the youngest victim. I know that. You know, we just want to have these voices in my stream. You know, it's a lot of effort to do this. Wait, guys, name another character. I'll see if I'll see if he exists here. So I'm gonna name a character. Okay, Kona. Nice to be an actual person. Inspector Gadget, Pikachu. Okay, that one's pretty easy. They must have Pikachu here. Pikachu. Okay, it doesn't look like they have Pikachu, but what they do have is they have Meowth. Everybody always wants me to say Meowth. That's right. But I can do way more than that. I just... I just wish people would recognize my other talents. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> okay. Let's see. Let's see what this sounds like.
Oh shit, I smell- did I smell Meowth? I smelled Meowth wrong. Hold up. I spelt it Meowth. <laughs> Alright, let's see what this sounds like. This is uberduck.ai. But we're trying to make it work with uh, Sammy instead of making it work in our browser so that you guys can type in stuff. Alright, let's try it out. Everybody always wants me to say me. That's right, Elf, but I can do way more than that. I just, just, I just wish people would go wreck a go job. I think, I think, I you like that. I I it's really dark, dude. He just he just gave up mid sentence. <laughs> he just gave up mid sentence. Everybody always wants me to say me. That's right, Elf, but I can do way more than that. I just just, I just wish people would go wreck a go job. I think I think I you like how like like how guys. <laughs> the fuck is this, dude? <laughs> okay. <laughs> um. What about? <laughs> this is another one. All right, name another character. We'll do one more character and we'll go back to installing this thing. What's another one? Recognizable voice. Hi, Nutty. You tried to do the blur effect in games as you have on your games, but for some reason, I, when I play COD after two, three minutes, uh, effect just turns off. Hmm. I, I don't know about that one. That hasn't happened to me. I've never seen that before. Scooby? Where are you? Like seriously, where are you, Scooby? The fuck, man? Where you go? Oh wait. Here it is. Scooby Doo. Scooby Doo. Give me a give me a sentence, chat. See, imagine if we can get this working. I won't have to ask you to type in a sentence. You can just do it yourself and it'll just happen, you know? Um, you know, I'm really tired of being pushed around by Shaggy. Um, he's always pushing me to go out and solve mysteries. When all I want to do <laughs> is fetch bones and uh, eat dog food. There we go. <laughs> Why ask for sentences if he makes up his own? Because uh, shut up, all right? <laughs> <laughs> it only did the one sentence though. Ah, it only did the one sentence. Okay. Raggy. Everyone says Scooby Doo. Nobody says Scooby. How do you do? <laughs> That's a good one, actually. That's a good one. <laughs> Wait, what? Very hugs, very hugs, say Scooby Doo, and nobody says Scooby Doo, Scooby Doo. What the fuck? <laughs> what is that? 
Very nice, say Scooby Doo. And nobody says Scooby Doo. No way, no way. Sentence. <laughs> Somebody get that dog a speech therapist. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Alright. Are we done with this? You want to start the control panel? Alright. Now, what do I do? Alright. How do I do this stuff? Tio, you there? Who, who can help me? I don't know what I'm doing. Apache. Uh, Tomcat. What do I do? Config. Editor browser. What do I do with this? I don't know what I'm doing. I have no idea Help Hang on I'm setting up the file on my site temporarily. Oh, you guys are so helpful. You know what I've learned today I've learned that the Sammy community even though I fucking hate Sam. I'm just kidding <laughs> Um, Even though I don't use Sammy what a bunch of great smart people, you know? Very helpful people. First, you gotta change your port. Okay. Wait, no. Hold up. Flipstream. Is your ser is your server like like public? Is that something I can I just use yours if you set if you set up, up in your one? Or are you setting up locally only? Oh, then we're just, I'm just gonna wait for Flipstream then. I'm gonna just wait for Flipstream. Temporarily, yes. Yeah, I mean, I, I, I won't... I'm not trying to set up something permanent. I just want to, like, try it out. How do I change my port? Or I can just do it here myself and not rely on you. Party at Flipstream site. How do I change my port? Apache config. Initialization file. Which one of these is a crypto miner? Yeah. H to to put conf. H to the conf. Okay. Port. Port, 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 port. Did you switch over to Sammy yet, Naughty? Naughty? It's been three hours. When are you going to switch everything you've worked on for the past two years to a new program? When are you going to do it already? What's taking you so long, homie? <laughs> I just set up Sammy for the first time, so we're just trying it out. I'm not, I don't have any intentions of switching over to Sammy. I just like, I want to see what it can do. You ever miss your old job? Uh, the one thing I miss the most about my old job was a, they had this thing that they used to do like every month, um, where they would just like put money in my bank account. <laughs> Dude, that was awesome. I love that part of my job where they just like, just load my bank account with money. Fuck, I really miss that. <laughs> it was some kind of policy they had that you just like fill up my bank account. They don't do that anymore. When they told me they fired me, I was like, are you still gonna, can I still take part in that part? And they're like, no. I was like, wait, what? What kind of bullshit is this? Yeah, that part was pretty good. Um, I don't really miss the, my job because I didn't really enjoy it, to be honest. But don't tell them that. They tried to hire me again. And they probably found out about my stream. They're like, oh, he's been talking shit about us? <laughs> no, it was just stuff I wasn't really passionate about. And this is the stuff I'm actually passionate about. It looks weird, but try this. Oh, okay. 
Nutty cores. Welcome to the cores. Okay, refresh. Is it gonna work now? Does it work with you? I bet it's still not gonna work. Did I do it wrong? The URL loading directly is weird. Wait, directly? Is that what he mean? <laughs> Interesting. Okay, so so then what do I do then? Like, what do I... It still doesn't do shit. So I put it in Sammy Bridge. Local host. Well, this isn't, this isn't my thing. This isn't local host. This is Flip's thingy. Sorry, I sh I, I'm responding to people that are talking about memes and stuff. And then all these other people are trying to help me. They're like, you gonna listen to me or what? I know it's not. Okay. So do local host. Um, wait, what? Local host what? I'm telling you... How to Zamp, bro. Visit local host. Okay. I got you, homie. I got you. I'm there. I'm not there. Oh, is it because I didn't start it yet? I didn't even start anything. I didn't, I didn't start. Do I have to start it first? Wait, you just have to change my port. Wait, there's f too many people talking, okay? I didn't change my port though, that's why I didn't start it. It's it's working in port 80. Is that a thing? Alright, I'm there. Alright, I'm on port 80. And copy cores into ZAMP HT docs. Okay. Yes. Stop yelling at me. <laughs> You don't have to, you don't have to, <laughs> you don't have to, you <laughs> okay. All right. I've, I've, I've put the file there. I put the file there. Yep. There you go. This looks better. Okay. I'll try both of yours out. Move this. Okay. Is this what I need? Stop yelling at me, Daddy. I'm just trying to make you happy. What do I need to do to make you happy, Daddy? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Um <clears throat> Yeah, it's supposed to be blank and I I understand that. But then what do I do on the Sammy side of it? Because according to this shit, I'm just supposed to I should just be able to do this. And then it's like no, it's not doing it, you know? Cores PHP. Cores light. Attempt to read URL null. Keep null. Uh, uh. Why? Why are you doing things that I don't want you to do? Computer. Gross. Okay. Where did that even come from anyway? Where is this script? I don't even remember where I got it from. Sorry, I'm too busy talking about... I'm too busy thinking about Waluigi. <laughs> is 
the PHP page, you'd have to install PHP processing into your local web server. Sounds like a lot of effort. It is expecting parameters you aren't sending. <laughs> the thing is, okay, the thing is, man, fuck all this, yeah? <laughs> <laughs> It needs a cores proxy because web browsers won't open file URLs for security reasons. Man, why can't we go back to the Windows XP days or Windows 2000 days where like everything was unsecure and everything and people didn't give a fuck? <laughs> So I don't know what's going on then. I don't know what to do. I don't even know where the, to, to be honest, I don't even know where this came from. This? Why does it look like this? Just download LimeWire. Wasn't there a thing called LimeWire Pro and you could download it using LimeWire? <laughs> You have the plugin installed in, in L, did you just call it LB? Excuse me. Did you just call it LB? In 2022, you call it LB still? Come on. I thought you knew better. Sorry, let me continue not being an asshole. And have you verified the triggering is working? Um... I have installed it, so it's here. Uh, I don't know how else I can verify it works. I mean, I have the thing here. I'm running the button, which I'm assuming this is correct, okay? If it's, in, if it's incorrect, then why does the example page look exactly the same? And why is it triggering an ID3 when I don't have an ID3? Open the console. Wait, hold up. Look for network messages. I don't see anything. There are none. On Sammy Bridge. Okay, okay, okay. Say message log, do I have to turn on message logging? Is that what I have to do? <clears throat> Oops. Okay, it did shit. Uber duck failure. Button ID three. Wait, what? It is. It was a. It failed. It said. It said failed. <laughs> Why did this fail? Why did this fail? Excuse you? F12 or control shift I? Control shift I? What the hell is that? Can you speak English? For fuck's sake? <laughs> Wait, where's the console? It's failing. Access, fetch, blah, blah, blah. Okay, so this is the same stuff that you guys were saying. It's still erroring, erroring out. That's the same error that was silent. Yeah, this is button three. This is ID three. <clears throat> So like, that was a failure. It set it to like local host and see if it works locally. Okay. All right. You right. Refresh. Done. Okay. All right. 
You gonna complain yet? Nothing happened. <sighs> what is this? Cool. Whoa, what is this? The hell is this? This looks like something. The hell is all this? Oh my god. I can't, I can't even, I can't even, guys. Oh wait, it, it did work. Something happened. Wait, something happened. Hello. Something happened. Okay. I don't know what happened, but something happened. That's the wave file. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Which means we have the file. Pizza. I want 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 pizza. Let's try different voices. I don't know where we get the voices from. I'm assuming the vo the bot name here is the voice. So if we put that here, does it just work? So it's not going to play the file, obviously. I don't know. Okay. So, so that worked. So it is downloading the thing. I want pizza. I want. But it still says I want. Pi okay, hold up. <laughs> Save it and run it. Is he gonna do it? How did we get that before? Maybe it's failing because this is an actual an actual voice. Why is there only three voices here? I want pot. I want pot. I want pot. I want pot. I want. So where do we get the voices from? Like the string that we put in here, because it only has three. But like, where do we get the rest of them from? I want pizza. 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 Yeah, I get it. I get that they only provided, but I'm sure I'm sure like where do we if we want to put other voices, do we just like where does the string come from? Look in the HTML source for the key in the drop-down menu. Oh wait, here it is. Yeah, speak, ZW, so where does that come, where does the name come from? How do I know what names put in there? It's the voice thing. Okay, but didn't I do that for Scooby-Doo? Scooby, Scooby-Doo, didn't I put that for Scooby-Doo or what? Bot name? Wait, that's... Hold up. Bot name. Okay. So we'll, we'll try ZWF. Let's put in ZWF and then run. And then we'll get... um. We'll get... I want up. pizza. I want pizza. Okay. <laughs> um, Let's do Scooby... The Scooby one. No, we'll pick a different voice. Two O's. Oh, it's with... Okay. Fuck, sorry, I don't know how to spell. Scooby do. Can it find it here? Maybe that's what I did wrong. Is I only put one O. Okay, let's try it here. Run. I want pizza. I want pizza. I want pizza. <laughs> that's not Scooby's voice. Okay, let's pick, let's do Sailor Moon. Let's do Sailor Moon. We'll do Sailor Neptune. Is Sailor Neptune in here? No? Okay, we'll do Mars then. View details. So it's the bot name. So I should be able to put the bot name in, right? I want bot. Uh. I want pot. Uh, I want pot. 
That doesn't... I don't... <laughs> I, don't think, I don't think that's the voice. I don't think that's the voice. Okay, it is working, I think. Okay, beautiful. Thank you guys so much for all of the help. Let's just choose a voice. Then. Let's choose a voice that will actually work. Like, let's get Eminem, right? Isn't Eminem in here? I thought Eminem... Rappers. Rappers. Let's get a... Let's get a... Oh, let's get... Do they have Ja Rule? No way. Do they have Ja Rule? Fuck, damn. I thought they had Ja Rule in here. <laughs> Uh, okay. What? Who's a good rapper, okay? Who's your favorite rapper, everyone? You know Wiz Khalifa? Oh my god, they have Wiz Khalifa? I love Chrono Trigger. It's my favorite video game. So we'll do it in the website, and then we'll try it from Sammy, and see if it- see how it goes. We'll compare the two. Mr. Dre? Okay, so here's Wiz Khalifa. How come drink this is my favorite day of game? <laughs> and then we'll do it again inside Sammy. Run it. Oh shit, sorry. Run. Save, run. No? Does this not work? It's not a voice it can do? Did I paste it in wrong? Wait. You wait. Okay, there we go. It's done. Paul Pete's. Paul Pete's. Paul Pete's. I'll peach. I'll peach. I'll peach. <laughs> okay. So it works. So how do we get Sammy to actually play that audio once it's done? Because that wasn't part of the thing. Is that a thing we can do? Play sound? Sound? Play sound effects? File path? That a thing we can do? Oh, it only does OGG files? Are you kidding me? Sammy doesn't do WAV files? Check the variables? It just shows this. It just shows that. You can't play OGG You can't play WAV files? How do I, like... That is a base 64 at least, so how do we do stuff? Sammy doesn't get paid enough for that. Well, what the hell was the point of... Okay, hold up. There's an example here. All of this is generated live. Okay, cool. So let's just see. Well, we can just use this as the example then, right? What is this? Scene? Text-to-speech? What is this? Visible. Oh, I th I see what they're doing. I think I know what they're doing. Is it just playing the sound inside of OBS? I think it's just triggering the source in OBS. It creates an OBS source pointing to the WAV file. Well, it doesn't create the source. It just assumes the source is already there. Right? Is that correct? It just assumes it's already there? Fuck, this is a lot of work. <laughs> like, it technically works, but like, it's a lot of work to get it to work. You know what I mean?
So let's add it to guys. Turn down your speakers, okay? I warn you guys. Turn your speakers down, okay? Um, I've warned you guys. I'm gonna let go of my mouse. Please turn down your speakers, okay? All right, please turn it down. Yeah. Follow Pete's. I I warned you. <laughs> I warned you. OBS like automatically like just plays it. I guess. Follow Pete's. I warned you guys. Follow Pete's. Oh shit. Yeah, I can't even hear that in my headphones because of the way that OBS works. Some of us like abuse, Nutty. Oh, <laughs> Pete. Okay. So, this isn't this isn't as like a this is a lot of effort, honestly. Um, but it's kind of good because we could. Potentially just make this work with streamer bot and s since streamer bot is just like You have a lot more freedom with what you do because of custom C sharp code We could probably do the same thing in streamer bot, but make it work easier there But we're not this is supposed to be a Sammy stream. So we're not going to talk about that right now <laughs> Source visibility change source visibility Scene name what? Why is it not showing my scenes? Hello? Show my OBS stuff. Connect. Damn it. Okay. So we want our reaction scene. We want to trigger the wave file. And then, oh, we're going to do something cool in OBS, yeah? Oh, Pete. We're going to do a cool thing. So in, remember that script I told you about in one of my videos? That Exeldro made? Disable source? No, not this one. It's a media, I think it's called media hide. I don't actually have it installed. It's going to come in handy right now. Assets. Um, scripts. Media hide. So now, anything I put in here, test.wave, as soon as I play it, oh, as soon as please. I turn this, so if I want to play the source, I just have to toggle it on. I don't have to worry about toggling it off. What up, Majin Julio? I had pizza last night. Hello. What up, Majin Julio? Oh, pizza. You see how, if I want to play the source, I just need to turn it on. Oh, Pete. Oh, Pete. And that it should work. So if I, if I run this, I like to party. It's not going to, I don't think this is going to work, but let's just try it out. Give the source time to generate the file and extension time to download the wave. You write. Missing request parameters. Excuse you? What did you call me? I'm like to party. It seems like it waits to be up. I think it waits. It waits till this is done, actually, I think. No? Or, uh, yeah, this probably need to put a little bit of time. Wait for timeout. Okay. Wait, can we, like, toggle these? Can we, like, just comment these things out? Is there a way you can just comment stuff out in Sammy? I just want to test if this thing works. That's what that variable, wait, wait for variable cool would be better. Wait, really? Wait until variable cool 
Wait for what? What are we waiting for, though? God, you guys are all so, so much smarter than I am. I wish I was smart. I just pretend like I'm smart. Wait until variable exists. Okay, cool. There we go. Done. Um. Yeah, is there a way I can just like... That's annoying. Let's just make a new button. Just for, for shiggles. This doesn't even work. This 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 part here doesn't even work. Oh, because it's okay. Wait, what the fuck? <laughs> I'm like to punch. I'm like to punch. Okay. All right. That's what I was doing wrong. Sorry. I thought I toggled this on. Okay. Let's try it again. Um, I love Chrono Tr Trigger. It is my favorite game. I definitely didn't sample their music in my songs, though. I would never do that. I like to punch. Ah, oh, fuck. It didn't. It just played right away. It just played right away. So I don't know if the. Do we have to delete cool after it's done? You need to delete it first. Okay. I'm learning how Sammy works, okay? Give me a minute to learn, okay, children? Delete variable cool. Yeah. Save. Okay, let's try it out. Is it going to do it? I'm assuming it's still downloading. You got Wiz Khalifa to do voiceovers? I mean, we're trying to. You leave the variable name empty, it deletes all local variables. Huh. I'm like to punch. Hey, I'm I don't know if it's still downloading it. It could be. I don't have any indication that it's still doing anything. <laughs> Is it still doing anything? I have no idea. Try shorter text. Poop. Run. There's an active buttons viewer. Okay, hold up. I can't... How do I... So is it, is it still doing shit? I don't know if it's still even doing shit. Can it not change it because it's in OBS? That might be what's happening because it's already in OBS. Well, that's lame. It would be cool if I could just play the sound, you know? Yo, can you guys like make it work with WAV files already? Thanks. <laughs> How do I like, because it only... Sammy only works with OGG files, with OGG files. So I can't even delete the text because it's in use by OBS. So this isn't going to work. Because I, I can't change, I can't change the, the contents of a file because it's already in OBS. What if I unload it? Oh, you can't, you can't unload, right? GMS2 literally has no way to play Wave. It converts everything to OGG on compile. I've looked into it. Well then, fuck. Well then, hold up. Let's go back to the example one, okay? 
What do they do here? Trigger pull, pull. So like, the fuck? <laughs> I don't understand how I'm going to be able to use it then. When we eventually convert it to another system, we will support it. But for now, we can't do anything. Gotcha. Just copy that source change, source change command. Which source, which source change command? What do you mean? Okay, what if we just do it here, yeah? What if, why don't we just stop fucking around and just like... Just do it. Do it here. I'll put in the name of my own source in here, yeah? Reaction. We'll just use whatever they have. I might to... I might to... Missing request parameters? Wait, what is this? Oh my, I'm not gonna fuck... Dude, I don't know what this code even does. So I'm assuming you trigger it from one button and the extension triggers another button when the file is done. Um, well, the problem is, the problem is chat, how do I, I just need to figure out how to get the actual audio to play. Shit, sorry. So we ran it again. This is too much effort, guys. <laughs> I don't even know if this is doing anything. Is it still downloading? Like, I don't know if it's even... Variable viewer. No, that's not... Sorry, that's not what I'm looking at. Active buttons. Waiting. Okay. So this is still doing stuff then, right? Because it says waiting. I can't get her to work and I gave up, streamer. I gave up just like I give up on everything. I think you're almost there. The default button has the wrong text-to-speech source name. Um, dude, what is going on? Why is it still waiting? Okay, I'm just gonna delete, and we're gonna do we're gonna do it again. Run. Active buttons. Waiting. So is it like still doing shit? They probably probably errored out. Okay. This is way too much effort. <laughs> this is way too much effort. I just wanted to have funny voices. It never creates cool. Uber duck ready. Wait, what the fuck? Wait, what? I never called that. This is a rough extension setup. This is, yeah, it's just a lot of effort. <laughs> I wonder if, um,. Cause I haven't even looked like I haven't even looked at the Uber Duck AI stuff anyway. I wonder if it's just easier to just straight up do in C sharp code. The extension triggers what triggers the save of the WAV file. No, I got that. I understood it. I understood that completely. Well, we had it working. And I don't know why it's not anymore. Let's just switch to a different voice. Oh, wait. It did create the WAV file just then. Wiz. How do you spell Wiz Khalifa? Fuck, I never forget how to spell his name. This. This. Wait, what the f- Wait, what the f- Hello? 
This is a test message. So this is fine. The scene item doesn't exist, which is whatever. But like, is it possible to update a... Oh. Update like a wave file that's already in OBS? You know what I could do? This is too much effort. I'm not gonna bother right now. I'm I'm ready to give up right now. I know I know what I can do to make it work. I just I don't feel like doing it. That's the source change command. Yeah, so what I would do is I'd create a new wave file every single time, right? Create a new wave file every single time. And then like just point it at point the uh, point the media source to the new file every time. Chuck everything in the that button except the speak command and edit the source name in the fourth button of the example deck. Wait, chuck everything in the button except the speak command. So you mean these three ones, right? That's what you're talking about? <laughs> this is too much effort. I don't feel like doing this anymore. It's just, it's too much. Like I'm, I'm realistically never going to use anything like this. Cause it's just, it's, I just wanted to have something fun. Copy. Paste, but then I have to put it at the end, right? Oh my god, why did it only do the one? I want all three of these. Copy all of these. What does the button say? Copy selected. There we go. And then we can move these to the top right. All right, so we did all that. I don't even know what the fuck any of this is for. Um, right? Is that it? Run. Is it going to do anything? Change <laughs> text to speech on command seven. Oh, what do I change this to? Oh. OBS error missing request parameters? Should be test wave. Isn't that what it says? Isn't that what it says here? It is test.wave. If you don't want to delete then the checkbox on the right turns off the commands. Oh, that's what I was asking earlier. Okay, I got it. Source name equals test.wave on command seven, not text to speech. Oh, I got it. Sorry, sorry, got it. Yeah, 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 yeah. I got you. I still don't understand that though. It's still not going to work. It didn't render. Dude, I'm giving up. This is too much fucking work. This is like, this is so stupid. This is, this is dumb. Disable the commands at the top. Which which commands? Which ones? Changing the source is probably fixing the cache issue in OBS. Yeah, th this is dumb. I don't I don't want to do this anymore. This is way too much work. All of the ones I added. So how is he gonna get the message that I wrote? What up, official J hypes? What up? You do that from the other button. 
What other button? Which one? You know what I'm saying? Like, which other button are you talking about? Because, like, none of the other buttons even called this one. Whatever they've done here, this, this stupid code, because, like, what even is ID3? What is ID4? Those things don't exist. None of those things are buttons. The one I made earlier. How do I run a but? This is too much work. This is dumb. I don't want to do it. No, I give up. I'm, I'm giving up. This is stupid. I don't want to do it. You can see or change the variable name from ID3 to whatever you want. No, this is dumb. Like, this example, like, doesn't even make any sense. Because this doesn't even exist. It's in the button settings. What's in the button settings? Wait, can you call buttons from other decks? Is that another thing you can do? Can you do that? Because this is from another deck. Is that, is that a thing you can do or you can't do that? You can only call buttons from the same deck. Ah, uh, yes, five ads to watch. Feed me the money, chat. <laughs> you saw me 20 years ago, now just a warning, we don't change. It's just like... <sighs> I feel like if you write an extension, I feel like... I don't know. There's there's obvious limitations, I get, because you can't w play WAV files and whatever. I thought it was going to be significantly easier than that. Um, I should have made a button that creates a new source, handles the trigger results, then only have make the speed command and automat auto magically works. About 30 minutes later, I would dive back into it thinking I can't let it beat me. Well, the thing is, I, I know I'm not going to bother with this later is because I, I'm not even going to be using Sammy. I'll tell you what this, what solution would probably work. I'll tell you what solution would probably probably work. What you do, and I'm not going to bother doing it because I can't, I can't be bothered. What you do is you create the source. And then once it's done playing, you delete the source. So every time you play a sound, it just creates a new source. You could probably do that and it would probably work. But I can't be bothered doing that. It's too much. It's too much to j just get this fucking. I'll look into this. I'll look into the uh, Uber Duck API, and then maybe I can code something that's like easier. <laughs> I don't know. I'll look into it. I haven't even. I didn't even look into it at all. Clone your voice. Wait, what? You're kidding. I can make my own voice? What does it cost pricing? How do I make my own voice? Clone your voice. Use it anywhere. Singing voice. Natural voice. Wait, if I clone my voice, can I only use it for a month? With Uber Duck? Man, we've spent so much fucking time on this Uber Duck, okay? <laughs> this is like... It's so tough. I'll look into it later. Alright, we'll look at more extensions. I give up. That's too much effort. I'm especially never going to make a video in that. Like, if I'm not going to make people set up their own web server just to use that. If that's how far they have to go, just to have the voices. What is this? Detect active window, lucky wheel, overlay for OBS, simple controls from LB. Okay. Channel points. Add more channel point commands. Patreon events delivered straight to your... Ooh, that's pretty cool. I don't have Patreon stuff linked to my stream at all. 
Pledge create. I know that streamer bot can do it, but I never got it to work. Members update pool. Supports, ooh, text-to-speech. Supports Google and Amazon. How do we, God, we got, you guys love text-to-speech, don't you? It works well if you want to create your own chat overlay. Wait, what works well? Sorry, I wasn't paying attention. Setup. Retrieving AWS poly credentials. Interesting. Do we set up text to speech today? Retrieving voices. We need to spend we need to spend one day setting up like text to speech in Twitch speaker. We need to spend a day doing that. Cause there's like there's so many like different voices you can use. But I don't have any I don't I haven't set up uh my key yet to use any of them. Speech engines. We can get like Google voices. I'm loving Twitch speaker. Yeah, I use Twitch speaker right now, but I only have access to the basic Windows ones. What about, okay, what other things are here? Christina's extensions. What does Christina have? Okay. Timer, Sammy timer. Allows you to dynamically set and delete as many timers as you want in Sammy. Control your stream. Easily create polls via chat or redeems. Discord message over message relay get folder file. Full Spotify control with OBS overlay. Oh shit, that's actually pretty pog. What are the coolest things about... Okay, Sammy people. What are the coolest things about Sammy that I could just set up straight up like that other people have made? OBS resizer. Resize your OBS scenes with a push of a button. Fuck, I'm going to do this one. Let's do this. Sorry, wait. Zero. I'll do, I'll give money later. Okay. <laughs> your email, your payment confirmation will be sent here. Oh my God. All right. All right. Leorn board two. The Spotify look works pretty pro flawlessly. Hmm. Okay. Christina's TTS is very good too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because they're using the same voices. I imagine like they're the same thing. Okay. Bridge. Install extension. Res resizer. Okay. Resize. Pressing this button will resize the selected sources. Nested scenes and their Okay. Wait, what is this? Holy shit. Should I just press the button and hope that it does stuff? <laughs> what does this even do? Resize. What do these buttons do? If you get a pop-up message warning you about resolution settings, OBS resize. If you have a backup of your OBS, I would be terrified of using that on my stuff. Yeah, I actually don't want to use this because I'm like, is this going to like move all my shit around? <laughs> is this going to move my shit around? I second that Christina's TTS is awesome. You can choose between Windows, Google, TTS, Amazon TTS, pretty cool stuff. Yeah, it's similar to Twitch speaker. Um, not that it's like a competition or anything, but uh, I've been using Twitch speaker um, because it has access to like the Windows 
obviously the windows one everyone has access to but then there's also amazon google and then a whole bunch of other stuff i've never tried i specifically requested this one acapella it has access to that you have tons of voices here as well but i haven't i haven't fully played around with this i need to set it up still it will move all your shit around okay i don't want to mess with this then <laughs> I think we're pretty much done with this. Oh, wait, we never set up the app. We never set up the app. Should we set up an, the app on our phone to like make it do stuff? Let's just make a really simple board and just set it up on our phone. I'm going to delete all this stuff. I don't even know what was in those buttons. I just deleted those. How am I liking Sammy? It's pretty cool. There's some stuff I like about it, but like, some stuff is kind of weird and intimidating. Um, it's overall pretty good. I'm not going to switch to Sammy, but I have a better understanding about like what, what it's capable of now. Because in some ways it's capable of a lot of stuff that streamer bot isn't. Um, but also like the other way around. You're weird and intimidating. Oh, you. Oh, you, camera Tim. Oh. <laughs> Um, okay, so let's, let's just set up some simple, like really basic, not any complicated stuff. I just want to see what the app looks like. So we'll set up like some basic scene changes. We'll set up some basic scene changes here. So we have like a, let's do our just chatting one here. Um... Just, just some critiques. I really think you should be able to change at least the button name from this window. I think that would make a ton of sense. But here you have to do it. There. Just chatting. Save. Yeah. Um, paste. Okay, we're just going to set up a whole bunch of buttons here. They don't have a scroll bar here for real. No, no scroll bar for me to scroll all the way down. Save. Reaction. Oh shit, this is the wrong scene. You can use the search bar to limit results. I know you can do that. I know. I'm a really big fan of being able to type to filter stuff out. Uh, a lot of the programs that I've written myself, I always put that in there. I told the guys, it's the streamer bot guys to do that as well. But I also think it would be nice to just have a scroll bar. Save. Okay, so we have super simple stuff here, yeah? Let's get this set up on our phone. We have a deck now. How do we do this? <laughs> we got to download Leoran board. Will this board import? All right, what is this? Uh, let me see. Oops. Paste deck. Sounds. <laughs> what is this? I'm scared. Well, this is this is not going to play sounds because this is this is your local file. These are all your local files, so it's obviously not going to play on my computer. But yeah, it imported at least with all the images and everything, which is nice. Where did it get the images from? That's weird. Does that that means it must be hosted somewhere? Where where are the images? Oh, it stores the image files as like. Yeah, okay, I got it. I got it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was wondering how it got the images. Okay. Um I wanna set up I wanna set up the phone app now. Sammy Deck. Open Sammy Deck. I wanna get the Android version. So I need to install this. Can I install this remotely from my PC? Yeah, yeah, I got it. Install this on my phone. 
It's still using the old logo. Hey, Sammy people, are they still using the butterfly <laughs> as the logo? Are they still doing that? The Orin board to stream deck. What up, Neon? What up? We're trying to set up Sammy. Okay, so we got it here. Port. Wait, URL? What the hell's the URL? Auto reconnect. Oh, that's my local IP address. Okay, hold on. Let me get my local IP or my PC. I don't know what it is. Okay, 109. Give me a second, guys. Bear with me now. Dude, why is the Android keyboard so stupid? I just want to type numbers, and whenever I put a number, it like switches back to the regular. I don't want to do that. <laughs> just let me put numbers, you dumb. Please. Stop switching. Stop switching. Oh my god, dude. <laughs> okay. Connect. Okay, load deck. Woo! How do I how do I rotate this? Well, we're, here it is. I, there's the page. It's on the phone, and then I should be able to switch scenes and stuff. Woo! Wait, we don't have a button for the for that camera. Copy button. Copy, paste. So we need one for the dual cam setup. And then we'll set one up for the multi cam setup as well. Dual cam. Paste. And then we'll set set up the multi cam. Where's the multi cam? Multi cam. Edit appearance. Multicam. Okay. Save. So now we can control this stream from our phone. Look at that. Got your IP docs. <gasps> I know where you live. 127.0.0.1. Epic Keeb design. You like my Keeb? It's one of many. <laughs> Look at the steam. Look at the steam, guys. You think I can sh I should stream from this I should stream like this for ultimate swag points. Can you hold the num key down? I don't have a num key. Who me? I should I should stream permanently from this angle for ultimate swag points. OMG brother, it's been so long since I've caught your stream. Still the coolest ever. Hello Milton, nasty mento. What up Milton? How are you? Um this is me definitely not looking up your user card to see when the last time you spoke to me was. I haven't spoken to you since uh, February last year, man. <laughs> what up? Follow age. Yeah, what up, Milton? Hello. That's pretty cool. I like the like, you can't really tell 
but like the animation when you do stuff I like that it's like a nice confirmation that stuff is actually happening I know I wasn't on Twitch for like nine months. What are you having a baby or something? You had a you had a whole ass baby. Okay, I think I'm done with my Sammy coverage for the night. I tried. I I did what I could. <laughs> Overall, I think it's cool. At some point, I'll do some kind of comparison video, talking about the differences and the things I like between Sammy and Streamer Bot. Ultimately, I'm going to stick with using streamer bot, but I do respect what the Sammy people are doing, even though I won't be using it myself. I had 120 babies, teacher. Oh, you're a teacher? Ooh. Hey, Naughty, random question. Is it possible to stuff check, man? That would search for songs on Spotify and play them on Spotify software instead of, like, YouTube. Um, I'm sure someone's already made that. Twitch, Spotify, song requests. I'm sure someone's already made that. Moobot? Does anyone still use Moobot? Spotify request bot. Um... Yeah, so this one looks like you have to actually uh, post the link. Whatever this is. I'm sure something like that could be programmed into streamer bot. Is it able to be done off streamer bot? Someone would have to program that. Uh, I haven't looked into it. I won't say with confidence that you could, but maybe you could. Something's burning there. Uh, yeah, that's just, um, uh, I'm doing, I'm, I'm, so one of the things I do is I multi-stream my stream. Uh, and I use the second stream is communicated using smoke signals. So there's like, there's a group of people down, uh, the other there that are watching my stream through smoke signals. So that's what I have this for. I'm pretty sure Christina spot a uh, Spotify extension for Sammy does that. Sorry for the flagrant promo. No, you can promo all you want. I've been talking about other people's stuff this whole time. That's totally fine. <laughs> I kind of feel bad when I'm like looking at Sammy's stuff and I'm constantly talking about like things streamer bot can and can't do. Like you guys were talking about text to speech and you're like, oh yeah, Christina's text to speech is cool. And then I was like, oh, but I use Twitch speaker. It, it just, I don't know. There's just, just, just there's just this weird like com competition thing going on between different programs that people feel weird about. And it's like, it's not a competition. It's just really a, it's just a preference thing, depending on what you want to use. 